Alrighty, Burbles. I am ready. I am ready to, to play the game. Tonight's game called Beast of Maravilla Island. On Steam it is saying Beast of Maravilla Island is a 3D adventure game where you take on the role of a young wildlife photographer who tra traverses Maravilla Island's magical ecosystem to discover extraordinary creatures, learn their behaviors, and most importantly, photograph their majest majesty. The reviews are very positive so far, and this game got uh, released last year, one and a half a year ago. And since then, I wanted to play it. <laughs> so there you can see, uh, backlog is very, very long. Developed by Banana Bird Studios. I really like this name. And I think that's also the reason. Do you see this bird here? I think, <laughs> I think this is a banana bird. It's like a toucan inside of a banana. And I think this is so, so sweet. Published by uh, White Thorn Games. And, I, and I'm pretty sure we played some of the games here. Um, let me see, because they're sounding so familiar. We have played, yep, they've published Lake, which what, which we played last year. Apico, also Calico, that's uh, also a very comfy game. We also played Teacup, and let me see. Those are the, the games I know, at least. Uh, yeah, and we played so many of them on stream, actually. Really, really good games. So I'm thinking this game is also going to be good for tonight. I think it's not that long, though. Um, but that's fine. Today we're gonna chill. Tomorrow is my off day, but Tuesday for Tuesday I will I will think about a, a new game I wanna I wanna showcase. I wanna showcase. Um, the tags for Beasts of Maravi Islands are oh not not islands but islands. Exploration, click, collectathon, puzzle 3D, and cute. Oh god, puzzle. Oh no, I didn't actually I didn't want to play puzzle games on stream, but okay, <laughs> we'll see how this one will be. We'll see. I hope it's not gonna be too bad. Uh, I will let it lurk here, but I'm heading to bed. I'm on my feet since 8 a.m. on Travel Towers with the train to my dad. I remember you woke up so early and yeah, I can imagine how exhausting these days can be. Thank you, dear Manu. Thank you so much for tuning in and have a nice day tomorrow. Yeah, Enjoy yourself. We are ready as well. That's good, Tess. That's good. I'm excited to play. I'm excited to play this now. Um, Let me see. I think I'm also going to go to performance mode. I didn't start the game yet, and I'm really hoping it's not lagging like yesterday. It's it's weird. Sometimes there the games are probably it's not weird, but it highly depends if things are optimized or not. Mm. Yesterday's game was not that optimized, <laughs> so I think you need a very strong PC. We'll see how this is gonna be here. If this is gonna be the case here, if so, uh, we'll I, I I think I will decide what we're gonna do. A new game. Let's start. I think it's going to be like Pokemon uh, Pokemon Snap, but we'll see. The world is full of magic, patiently waiting for his senses to become sharper. WB Beats. Oh. When I was young, my grandpa used to fill my head with crazy stories. Let me make it a bit louder. Magical Island. As I grew older, I knew better than to believe in old fairy tales. So... Why am I doing this? Going to a fictional place I only remember in my dreams. My dearest Marina, do not mourn me when I am gone. I have lived a life in service of the beautiful creatures of this earth. A lifelong passion I hope I've passed on to you. People think of Maravilla Island is a myth. And every day, it is losing itself, yet nobody can act. How can we say what we do not know? Notice the stories living around me. Everything is interesting. Look closer. <laughs> That's the banana bird. <laughs> so, I leave you my camera and my journal. Photograph Maravilla's majesty. So it is called Maravilla. Back something beautiful to share with the world. <laughs> no, I like this game already. There are lots of birds. The loading screen is also birds. 
So the question is, is this game running well here? Okay, I am on my own uh, from here until tomorrow morning anyway. Uh, also the question is, should I play with mouse or keyboards? Um, I think I'm gonna take my controller here. Uh, today I tried out Half-Life fan game called Hunt Down the Freeman. Everyone kept saying it's bad and I expected as much, but I didn't expect it. <laughs> it would be that bad, no? I'm sorry to hear. Uh, weren't you excited about this? Oh no, this is this is <laughs> what I'm fearing with Hogwarts Legacy. Please don't mess it up. Please don't mess it up. I know I'm mentioning this game again, but I am very hyped. It's I'm not hyped often, but I'm hyped for this one. It's it was the first game I have refunded. <laughs> well, at least. At least you can refund. I'm, I'm glad about the Steam policy with that. You could try it out and you can make make up your own opinion. This is also important sometimes just just to see, okay, um, some people no, might not like a certain aspect of gameplay or story or whatever, but it's, I think it's always important to make your own uh, opinion up there, right? Game has an achievement called Hunt Down the Refund and it's received by refunding it. No way. I think I never saw this kind of achievement. Funny. It's kind of funny. I never heard of that. So it's on purpose. I'm so bad or what? Nah. <laughs> Gosh, I hope this is the right island. Otherwise, this is going to be one short adventure. <laughs> Let's see. Well, it's looking good so far, right? A and I can't play it with controller and mouse. Give me a second. Uh, I'm gonna plug out my my controller. What was that? <gasps> no, it is working. I, f I just feel more comfortable with with mouse, uh, mouse and keyboard, mouse. <laughs> Whatever it was, it looks like it's a uh, it's gone now. Am I going crazy? No, no, no. I also saw it, but that's also something. Uh, uh, here, right? What's this? It's a big bug or something right on the tree. <sighs> this is a lovely game. I hope you enjoyed as much as I did. Oh, you know this one. Hi, Slop. By the way, I saw <laughs> I saw your tweet today. I <laughs> felt so sorry I didn't check my, my tweets or just in, in general Twitter. I didn't check it for a couple of days. And then I saw you tag me. That was so sweet of you. <laughs> you are so kind, Joe. Thank you so much for that. <laughs> Actually, you should nominate yourself there. I really wanted to write this there. <laughs> because it could be better if the devs put effort into it, but it, I, but it didn't really feel like Half-Life and the gameplay felt kind of clunky. No, that's that's okay. You you tried it at least, you know. I think that's just important to figure out your own opinion here. Yep, I think oh, you did well. Of course, I hang out here every time I see you online and I'm not available. I love this place. Oh, you're so sweet. No, thank you, Joe. Thank you. <laughs> Merry Christmas to you, by the way. Happy holidays. <laughs> Hi, how are you doing? I'm sorry. I was, uh, I didn't ask how you, are, how you are doing. Am I going crazy? A WSD move. Okay, that's good. It, we've got a journal. Oh, that's nice. I ran into some foul weather on what should have been a routine research expedition. And my vessel has been blown severely, of course. This may have been a blessing in disguise. However, as the place I've washed ashore is unlike anything I've ever seen in my life. The flora and fauna here are so unique and that they bore down an alien to me. And I've seen no signs of other human activity. Meaning this may, may be an untapped fund of scientific discovery. Since I've been unable to locate this place on any map, I've taken it upon myself to give it a name. The moniker I choose means wonder, a reference to the inexplicable feeling that comes over me when I stare into its depth from the shore. Henceforth, this journal will be a record of my explorations and discoveries of the mysteries of Maravilla Island. That sounds super nice and I really like uh, the sketches here. Oh, singing jungle. That's also super nice. Uh, oh, this is the picture where we we saw earlier when we were when we were on the on the boat. I'm not sure if that was a boat or a ship when we were traveling <laughs> to this island. My dearest Marina, we cannot say what we do not know, so it is our duty to share the magic of this island with the world. Oh, this is the text of Papa, but we're gonna read it again. However, we cannot preserve that which we harm. 
When I took magic from the island, I lost magic within myself. The respect you have for this island allows you to create deeper connections with its creatures than I ever could. Finish my mission, Minieta Preciosa, and remain humble, for we are all based on this earth. There is magic all around us. We just have to look for it. Papa Vasco. I think it's just uh, very important also for me to be, uh, I don't know if you're taking me saw some things from the nature. Oh, I <laughs> just wanted to, <laughs> just wanted to pick some stuff here. Um, I think you should also give it back again. Whistle. Oh, okay. And then I can take pictures. Oh. Oh, this might be, t I think this might be actually better with controller because Z and X are pretty far away from me. Um, <laughs> because I got the German keyboard. <laughs> um, yeah, <laughs> this is, I don't think I can quickly s uh, switch that. Oh, round a ruby beetle. Damn, this is probably better. If <laughs> yeah, English keyboard is definitely better here. Damn, what am I going to do now? A great job that beetle was creature of the island. Oh, so it is. Also, like, what was the game we played? Um, uh, Marsh, something with Marsh. What was it called? Um, Marsh, not Marshmallow, Marsh. Pi Paradise Marsh. It's also like this a bit. I also like that. Not the best day, sadly, but hoping it flies by soon. I hope so as well. I hope so as well. I'm, al I'm always saying this date is not forever. Things are going to get better again. Just not a fan of Christmas anymore, it seems. Perhaps when I leave my home, I'll be able to find some joy. We're pleased to see you and some other friends around, though. <laughs> I, I hope so as well. I, I hope you can do this. And uh, maybe it's going to look different next year. I hope so. I really hope so. Because you're only deserving the best. Animals are placed in your photo book based on which environment you found them. So this is the crystalline books. It has also some, uh, something of uh, bug snacks a bit, right? It also... <laughs> just, just read your message. It also reminds me of the photo collecting bug... Oh my god, yeah. It is... Yeah. It like bug snacks. Oh god, I love this game. Use AJ to flip the page. You can find the different environments of the island. In the photos you've taken by turning the pages. Press escape to put your photos away. You can always open up it again, open it again by pressing F to look at the photos. All right. Easy clap. Then, oh, you can already see the names of uh, the box here. Or, oh, no, this is... Okay, what is this here? Natural shot. Some masks, right? Box. Maravillan, Maravillan uh, butterflies. Birds of the canopy. Oh, that's my favorite one. It's super nice. And kakapos are also here. Banana peel to <laughs> I like this one. The next one would be Flora, some uh, some flowers, and it's even it is has even two pages, I think. Yes. And then there are landscapes, and <laughs> selfies. Hmm. Can also take selfies with birds. I would love that. This, this is so spooky how you and I think so like I know, right? I'm <laughs> thinking the same quite often actually. We are very similar in that, with that. Yeah, it's it's crazy. <laughs> We're also creepy sometimes. <laughs> Not creepy, but spooky. Where there are critters all over the island, I wonder how many I can find to photograph. We'll see. All right. So am I going to sneak around the whole time? No, right? No. But I, I can already feel I will I will like this game. So let's look around a bit. I think we're sneaking automatically when we're coming closer. I want to see birds, 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 birds. The upper glit. Oh, we could also take a picture of the beach. I'm always doing this. Isn't this looking nice? <laughs> Photo book. No, take a picture. Oop. Landscape. Selfie mode. <laughs> yeah, I can't take pictures with birds. Hey, look at me and this big box. And there are even uh, emotes, right? Oh, I can smile. <gasps> Look at my face. Hmm. This is a bit worried. If I'm ever going to find a spider, that's going to be me. Not that. Oh, no, that's going to be me. <laughs> kind of sus looking. I want to smile. This is nice. <laughs> I got an achievement in ways of species. What's that? 
take a selfie. <laughs> oh, wait, you can have other positions as well. Oh, how did I do this? Wait a second. Ah, I can do this. Uh huh. <laughs> it's fun. All right, let's go into the jungle. Wow, there's so many things going on. With those, uh, those, oh my god, they're looking delicious. Like uh, some red drops, right? <laughs> Hello and Merry Christmas, Merry Christmas, Goomba. Welcome to the stream. Hope you're doing well. These are unlike any critters I've ever seen back in Los Angeles. I, 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 I read bet about this in Grandpa's journal. Ah, I bet Grandma wrote about this in his journal. Um, new objective edits. Okay, let's see. Uh, I remember I used to love flipping through this journal as a kid. It's been a long time though. I remember, I barely remember what's in it. Oh. I should jot all these animals down so I remember what to look for. Crystalline box. The box of Maravi Islands consists of many durable species. Gem like structure in, in, on abdomen. It appears to crystalline, uh, the crystalline structures on their bodies are not present from pupation. Rather, the creatures build them up throughout their adult life, minus the giant's nails. Faceted crystal shell. Although, oh my god, those sketches are so nice. Maravian butterflies. The Maravian uh, butterflies exhibit unique, striking patterns. Some of them even disguise themselves to look like other animals. This makes them particularly intimidating or confusing to predators, but to us it gives us a sense of wonder. I like markings. <laughs> Super nice. I like this a lot. <laughs> this is so, so cute, by the way. It's making me smile instantly. Um, I think it is a small reference to the developer team because their studio is called Banana Bird Studio. So it's... <laughs> <laughs> it warms my heart. A quick observation of the jungle's canopy greeted me with some kind of some of the most curious birds. They have penchants for mimicking the native flora of their home, specifically flowers and fruits. Banana peel? <laughs> Imagine my surprise when I went to take a cutting of a plant, only to have what I assume to be a flower fly off from my hand. <laughs> this is uh, the letter again. Alrighty. I hope we're not scaring uh, the birds away. That would make me very sad. <laughs> Grandma always said, no, Grandpa always said this island and its inhabitants were magical. I see that now. Oh. The more photos of animals I collect, the more people will understand and care about this island, like you did. I hope so. I hope there won't be, <laughs> there won't be a big company taking care of this island. T by c taking care, I mean destroy this island. Um, yeah. I can already see a butterfly behind me. Ooh. Is this, by the way, the, the same bug I took a picture of? Uh, journal. Uh, all gem bugs, all butterflies, all birds, all plants. So this is some kind of quest log. Um, journal, give me a second. Objective. We're gonna go, wait, this is on my photo book. Sorry, I made a mistake. My photo book is with F. A round ruby beetle. I think this is this one. Yep. All right. Um, set as me. Full screen. Oh, you can see the picture better here. What does it mean? Set as main. I oh, will figure out. We'll figure out. And there is this butterfly here. Alrighty. <laughs> there is even the the DSLR sounds. Show me your wings. Oh. Prison winged butterfly. <laughs> so nice. Uh, we can also look it up here. It's right here. Prison winged butterfly. And you can also do this full screen. Mm hmm. I just wonder what this means. Set as main. Okay, what else do we have? Also, yeah. The flowers, right? Chipping orchids. Maravian uh, angel trumpets, rainbow Maravian anthurium. Uh huh. Oh, thank you for the lurk pan. Thank you. A pink cap button mushroom, banded bornico mushroom. Okay, should I just take pictures? I mean, I think we've got enough film. I think it's called right. 
And I think I'm... Oh, there are more here! I only saw this single one. Okay. Damn, so many things to take pictures. Oh, this is new! Oh! Yeah, this is new. Then let's take a picture. Is this an... Oh, God. Orchid? Yeah, it is. Wow. Wow, my mom would be so proud of me. <laughs> it is a dripping orchid. It was kind of looking similar. But I'm not a flower expert, unfortunately. So this is the same flower, right? It's so beautiful here. Oh, yeah. And um, yeah, I, I can crouch with a shift, by the way. Uh -huh. What is this flower here? Let's take a picture. That's also new. Maybe it's better from the other side. Rainbow bromeliad. Bromeliad? Would be nice to get further information. Just a little text. But I don't think we have this here. Mm. Uh, bromeliad. I think it's called like that. Probably, yeah, it's probably looking better from the other side. I'm pretty sure. A little water break. I got my water here. Thank you for reminding me. <laughs> mm. Water. <coughs> Where were we? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I wanted to go this way a bit. And I think this is also the same flower. What is this orange thingy? Is that just a Oh! <laughs> Those are birds, right? I'm already uh, okay. I'm already going crazy because I saw birds. Why am I like this? And this is also something new. Yeah, this is definitely looking oh. better. Oh, I think I, I think I remember Grandpa mentioned that the plants on this island are photosensitive. What does that mean exactly? Oh. Maybe the flash that my camera makes will be enough to make that glowing flower bloom. Oh, okay. As long as we're not destroying things, right? <laughs> oh my god, you're flexing your wings! What? Open your wings again! Oh my god, a shelled finch! How could I flex, not flex? <laughs> oh, with Q. Can I also do this when, when I'm taking a picture? This is very sweet. I like this a lot. Uh, my journal. I'm always pressing J here. Uh, not journal, but um, F. This one. What's gonna happen if I'm don't if I don't have a uh, film left anymore? Oh, now I can say this is gonna be uh, this is gonna be my main picture. Of course, we're gonna take uh, fla flexing birds. So it reminds me of my Zazu boy. <laughs> This is a plant I should also take a picture of. I think this is or this glowing one. J for journal every time. Yeah, I am. <laughs> I am uh, kind of pressing J. I there are so many games where you're having J's journal, right? But journal is R here, <laughs> which is confusing. Um, but that's okay. I can get used to it. You see, that's nothing new, but this one. This one is nice. A glowing. Sparking. Oh! Sparking lamp lily. <laughs> this game is very, very magical. It's like uh, I'm having a lesson in, in, in Hogwarts right now. <laughs> it's super nice. I understand. <laughs> oh, okay. That w I don't know what, what was that crash a little bit now that's photosensitive all it needed was a little flash to short to shoot a beam of light <laughs> <laughs> and the stock is grew it grew it's something out of a fairy tale hmm. oh you're right well if it's anything like the fairy tale i might be able to climb it um yeah with the bean but i didn't see everything yet w w I, I will come back again it is this just another color by the way yeah, I think that's just another color. Oh, you can also zoom in with your mouse wheel. That's also nice. I wanted to get another picture as well. Okay. 
My character can't run, by the way. Do we have this flower? Wait, oh my god, there are so many things growing. I like the burbles here. Are they all flexing? <laughs> They're all flexing a bit. He flexes in chat. Oh, this is also new. Lobster claw. Looking like one of those plants um, who e uh, which are eating flies as well. And the blue one. Also new. Oh, this seems like a very cozy game. <laughs> Yeah, I like uh, I like taking pictures in game. You need to be so patient in real life, so so patient, to to get some good pictures. I think we can move on now. What did we see? I can't completely look up to the sky. There is uh, some kind of a limit, but I think the game wants us to to walk this way. Mhm. Mm so we got the rainbow bromeliads here. Um, then the lobster claw. Oh, I like this one a lot. I like the colors. Um, it's so complementary with the orange and the green. And we got the Vesco Nintri Orchid. Super nice. And <laughs> in landscapes, I don't know. If ocean got something very fascinating to me. They always reminding me a bit of infinity. Of course, I know it's not infinite, but it's giving you a... I don't know, it's giving me a moment of calmness. Um, I'm just enjoying the, the quiet moment, if I can hear the birds and the waves. It just, uh, I don't know, it warms my heart. <laughs> I think it's just very natural um, that human being is kind of attracted. Not attracted, but we are all... I, I, I mean, who's not enjoying to see the, the ocean? It does need to be warm. Also like to be at the ocean when it's cold. I always thought when I was a kid, I always thought like seeing in a, a beach with a snow is kind of weird. But of course, <laughs> it's also part of nature. It's not always hot around there, right? You like green? This game is very green here. Very tropical, Goomba. Let's see. Oh, we can. <laughs> okay. Oh, I can also go to the left side. Okay. Wait, did I? I didn't take a picture of this one. Maybe I should. Let go. Let it go. Oh no, I'm so sorry. Let it go. Da, 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 da. That's enough. Oh, now I can look up. Now we can see the sky. I feel so small. I feel very small. I like this one as well. Uh, then we're gonna. Now we're gonna climb up. Wait right here. Let's go. <laughs> Maybe we can see something else. Can we also take pictures while we're climbing? No, that's not possible. All right. Then we can't miss out things. Except looking around. Looking around and maybe find others. That, what? Others? What? what? I th <laughs> hmm. Those are not butterflies, but also not birds. What am I going to do now? I can't climb up anymore. <laughs> you also see you see this, right? Sitting on the other tree. What am I gonna do? Let it go. Oh, I will probably I have to let it go here. I think I climbed a bit too much. Oh, we're on the other side. There you go. <laughs> it it was like just like the fairy tale. Oh, on top of the branch they seem so familiar. So what is this exactly? Yeah. Yes, their tail twining is a giveaway. It's a, a Maravian queso beard, beard? Monkey? Mm. I should look at the journal. Let's see. Rainbow crested Quetzal monkey. <laughs> ah, okay. Dude, Quetzal, those, those birds are looking absolutely amazing. They are looking so beautiful. If you never saw them, I'm recommending Look, watching some, looking at the pictures, and then you, you are like, "Yep, I kind of want to watch a documentary about them." There are some good ones about uh, these fascinating birds, actually. This monkey of paradise chooses to nest in the understory layer of Maravillas forest, hiding from predator, predator, predators. I'm always having trouble to 
to pronounce this properly. Decorative crest. Okay. I just like the birds. <laughs> Are these affectionate monkeys twine their tails together in times of stress? Just like to, or just to let one another know that they care. It's as comforting to them as a hawk. I was about to say, <laughs> as a thawk. <laughs> These monkeys sometimes twine tails all night and wake up with mm, that head on their fur. <laughs> they glide among the higher branches and feed on fruits, leaves, and some insects. White feathers. <laughs> the classification of these animals becomes more complicated upon study. Are they avian? Primates? Primavians? <laughs> hmm, that would be that would be interesting. These creatures like to sing in their spare time. They copy each other's tunes to create a symphony, just like Leo and Zazo. It will be a miracle if I get any sleep during my expedition. <laughs> These monkeys have a unique relationship between their courtship, dance, and light. Exposure causes their fur and feathers to change color. An experience that in sunlight that penetrates the canopy isn't enough to trigger uh, a action, reaction, but a strong beam of light has stunning results. Incredible. The light of my life, Vasco y Mira. <laughs> That's sweet. Alrighty. So oh. those were the information I was looking for. It's always nice to read a bit about the, the animals who are living here in this uh, forest. Rainbow Crested Quetzal Monkey. Grandpa was quite the scientist, but these colorful friends are just cute bird monkeys. <laughs> Wait. Bird monkey? Binky? Much better. <laughs> it says in the journal that these creatures twine their tails together. I should get a photo, but they are doing this together when they are stressed or when they're falling asleep, right? Oh, hi, Ibayu. Hi, I'm, I'm doing good. What about yourself? Thank you so, so much again for helping me out. That was super kind of you. I, I met I met <laughs> I met Ibrahim over um, over the Dare Drop Discord because I had a question. Had no idea how to. <laughs> oh God, I'm such a boomer. I had no idea how to put a music, how to put music to to a TikTok video. That was my very first video, and I put so much effort into it until I realized, ah, okay, a TikTok video is only one minute long. So yeah, the rest of the video is having no sound, but yeah. <laughs> the first first minute got some sound. But thank you so much. You were such a huge help. That was so, so kind of you. <laughs> I'm doing good. It's, it was a fun day. <laughs> That's good to hear. I'm glad. Thank you so, so much again. It's also very kind for, for stepping by. Very kind of you. Thank you. <laughs> glad you're doing good. Wait, I just need to take a picture now, right? What's this, by the way? Is this? Oh, this is also new. I don't want to scare anyone away, though. Let's see my bits. Even though I'm taking, well, this rock is taking so much space, so <laughs> so when I have this in my focus, this would be uh, could be also nice. But the rocks are not nice. That's not a hmm, not the perfect picture. So what's this? Rainbow Maravillan Anthurium. Okay, <laughs> TikTok work in a different way. I figured out. You, are you also new to TikTok? I, <laughs> I never used TikTok before. And I really thought, I really tried to put the music over the website, so over my desktop, but it is impos it's impossible. So I, <laughs> I had to download the TikTok app over my phone just to add some music. It's crazy. It's actually crazy. I also, I, th I, th I think it's weird when... Um, Smartphone applications are not optimized for desktops at all. I think that's just weird. I did like two videos. <laughs> I feel you. I feel you. But I, I saw you. You're getting lots of clicks over there. I think a TikTok might be uh, very interesting if you want to grow. But I think that's just not my platform. I tried. I tried. Maybe I will do it again. Same for Instagram. Yeah, Instagram is working the same. It's very annoying. It's just so annoying. There, I'm, I'm using a trick where I'm simulating that I'm on a <laughs> that I'm on a on a yeah on a smart device, and not on my on my desktop. It's it's crazy to me, but yeah, <laughs> maybe I just need to get used to it. Those are the bird monkeys now. Let's see if we can take a nice picture. They're looking very fancy. 
And we're not stressing them now. Boop. Binky's tail swinging. So what's going to happen if we're going to sing? Not sing, but... Are they going to imitate me? No, right? Tree orchid. Let me see. We've got a new entry here. Oh, what's a cute photo? Where should I put it? Uh, let me see. We're probably having it somewhere automatically tail swinging. There is a primary creature in each environment in the jungle. It is the rainbow crested quetzal monkey. Every primary creature has four documented behaviors. When you capture one, it is an objective photo. Objective photos will appear in the labeled spots under the environments in the photo book. If you take more photos of the same subject, select the displayed photo in the photo book to view those new photos. So you can decide for the main one. We figured this out. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, hello, dudes. Hello, you made it. <laughs> no, that's very cute of you. Hi, how are you doing today? Welcome to the stream. Uh, that's a version is different from phone app. Yeah, for sure. I I just hope they're going to change that at some point. But it's Instagram is also existing for several years and they didn't do that. I think they just want to... The target group is just people who are using their phones a lot. I guess they want us to use the... Yep, I think so as well. I think so as well. It's... It's, I will never understand. I will always prefer a bigger screen just like my desktop um, instead on my phone. I don't want to work with my fingers. That's never precise like, I, like I'm doing it over with a mouse. I, I will never get used to it. <laughs> so that's going to be super hard for me. Very, very hard. Do you collect the free games on Epic, Epic Games? Always, always. This time it's really, really good. Um, that, that Stranding, right, it was called. Actually, one of the games I wanted to try. I really wanted to uh, try this one, and I'm glad I didn't buy it back then. <laughs> it's a very pricey game, and now it's just for free. It's a really good game, I think. I really want to try this one. Is it, did you play this one already? I mean, already? It's, I mean, it's already two years old, right? My God, the time is just flying. <laughs> you can replace the display photos at any time by selecting from these extra photos. Try taking several photos of the tail twining. Twining? Twining, right? Binkies and select your favorites. Okay, so this we're just gonna do that because that's part of the quest. Oh, this is also a big flower. That's a chunk of flower, and I'm getting dis <laughs> why am, why am I singing? <laughs> this could be a nice one. But I think it always needs to be in the middle. Could be get could get it could get a bit boring if you're always taking pictures like that. That's not a yeah, you don't have a big, yeah. <laughs> it's always the same composition, let's say it this way. But I'll do it. Jan, oh, it's a lotus flower. Someone sparkle here. Jan, uh, giant jungle lotus. So pretty. And uh, then I am gonna turn around. Never mind. <laughs> I'm not finding. Oh, there you go. There you go found them again. They're so pretty. It's a very colorful game for sure. Uh, so Oh, it's looking like there's even a, a flower at the end of the tail. <laughs> a booty picture. So we did this now. Uh, journal? R. It's not J. Uh, Binky, Binky's gliding, singing, dancing. I... I think that's going to be um, like in Pokemon Snap where you have to come back again. Or they're going to do this in other scenery. We'll see. Tomorrow, I guess it's a nice one too. Then the rest is indie games. I, I don't mind this at all. Um, sometimes they're <laughs> even better than AAA titles, to be honest. Um, highly depends. I'm, I'm excited to see this one as well. But I think Death Stranding was already a very, very good one. They... I mean, I saw they also repeated some of the games, but I also don't mind that. In case you already missed this last year, then you get the chance. You had the chance to. Itch, you had the chance to get this, uh, to get the games this year. Then. Been doing all right. How are you doing? Feeling a bit better? Yes, I'm feeling a bit better. Thank you. Thank you very much. That's very kind of you asking. That's very very kind of you. Hi, Pan. Welcome back. Hi. <laughs> Welcome back. All right. Um. Oh, yeah, we had to go back to the book. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Set as main. But I don't want to. I like this one. But I think we have to now. 
Now I'm gonna take the other one again. <laughs> Even though this is also nice. <laughs> All right, what's next? What are we missing here? Do we have this blue flower tree orchid? I like this <laughs> DSLR sound. It reminds me of myself when I was uh, roaming around with my camera. Oh, that's a big... Oh, it's a bridge, actually. Uh-huh. Good to hear. <laughs> that's very kind of you asking again. Thank you. Thank you for doing that. Oh, is this new? No, rainbow. Do, don't we have this also in Stardew Valley? I think so. Hello. Oh, what's this? Who's that under the tree? Hi, buddy. Hmm? I heard something, but I couldn't figure out. Wow, hiding very well here. Maybe it'll come say hi if I whistle. <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> you cutie. Okay, you've got me with birds. <laughs> <laughs> it's a mango kakapo. <laughs> no, that's sweet. <laughs> kakapo. They're also not living everywhere. I think they're only living in New Zealand, actually. I will probably never gonna see those animals. Same with cardinals. Oh, this is also new. Let's see. You can beak butterfly. <laughs> oh no, once you know, of course, it's a toucan beak. Wait, what's new? This one, those are spores, right? Pink capped button mushroom. That sounds delicious. <laughs> but we're gonna we're not gonna pick anything up here. I don't wanna destroy this place. I would not do it. Uh dipping orchids. Done. The mushroom is also done. And then the anthurium. Anything else? Oh yeah, the landscapes. I like this one as well. I, I did so many pictures of this, just of the sky. Maravillan mango kakapo. Cutie. It's looking like a bee a bit, right? <laughs> Where do you fi keep finding these cute looking games? Um, I've got a trick. I actually got two tricks. Every day I'm checking out the new releases over Steam. There's a super nice SteamDB page with the upcoming 30 days. You can look up um, which games are um, highly wishlisted. Then you can go through. But a little warning, you're going to see lots of, um, let's say, sexy games. <laughs> Um, I am. I'm not. I kind of block them over over Steam. Y there is a setting where you can't just block them because they were getting on my nerves at some point. It just f over flooded with that. Um, and then the other one is I am highly recommending. I'm highly recommending uh, following the Wholesome Games channel. They have uh, they have uh, Twitter. They have TikTok. As they are also having YouTube. But they are very very active over social media and they're always showcasing new games and. Uh, once I saw the, once I'm seeing the trailers, it's most of the time it's on my wish list. When the game is coming out, I'm also getting uh, a nice e email by Steam. Hey, this game is out, out now or is in early access now, so I'm not missing out anything. So I'm always keeping an eye on stuff like this, plus all the trailers, of course, um, over, for example, Gamescom or other games convention or awards or game awards and whatever. So um, this is a, a good way to to keep updated with all the. Uh, wholesome Games, but Wholesome Games itself um, is super nice curated with um, with games like this, which maybe um, are not having a big uh, audience, um, but I do think they're also deserving some some yeah attention because the games are actually so wholesome and it's just making you feel good. <laughs> Where can I find this list? Asking for a friend. Give me a second. Um, I can give you a list. Okay, not a list, but give me a second. I got it in my in my browser. Uh, got a Steam. Yep, Steam. Mom <laughs> moment. Steam new releases. I got it in a second. Because I think this is just so much better to see. 
don't let me no it's completely fine it's it's nice when i can talk to people otherwise i'm just talking to myself right so this is the one website i'm talking about and then there's a there's a channel over twitter and you will also see this um these creators uh, over other social media but this is the one i'm following and it's a great channel. It's a really great channel. They're also doing lots of giveaways as well. Um, when they're collaborating with other indie indie developers, they're doing lots of giveaways to where you can win um, the game keys as well. What did I hear? Yeah, sexy games. That's what I said. <laughs> yeah, I am. Um, I do not mind them, but if I'm constantly seeing them and I'm feeling like I'm missing out a lot of other games because of that. Then I'm like, I'm, I'm getting annoyed. I'm, I'm just getting annoyed and <laughs> I don't want to get annoyed. So there's a setting over Steam. I don't know what it, what exactly I did. It's been a while since I did this. But I am not getting s any suggestions or I can't even see them over the Steam list. So that's very, very useful. Mm -hmm. I'm glad you're asking. I'm glad you're asking. <laughs> Literally the first one I clicked was, yeah, I know, because, <laughs> because sex sells. <laughs> That's just, yeah, it is how it is. Either I have some kind of filter active I'm unaware of or something, but I've never seen those uh, kind of games when I browse Steam. Maybe there's a filter. I have no idea, but I didn't have the filter and I put the filter on after I realized, yeah, there is, there is this possibility. Thank you so, so much for the work, Ibrahim. Thank you. I appreciate it. Can we just go down here? We can, right? Uh-huh. I also like the sound. I like the, the tropical nature sound. This is also one of the reasons why I love Tomb Raider. I love the jungle theme. And this is also the reason why I love to play Kena. That's the website that lets you see how much money you wasted on games, is it? <laughs> Also that. They're having also a super nice website when you are going to the main page. Um, give me a second. Mm, I got another link. You can also save this one because it's super useful. A friend of mine showed me this one. Because that overview is also so, so much better than over Steam. Steam is just stylized. But this one is giving you a good overview. Uh, SteamDB.info and then, and then slash sales. Um, there you can see the good deals. Uh, you can also see the the historical low. Um, you can you can see so many so many stats here. It's super nice. You can browse browse around even faster, in my opinion. Um, and this uh, and this link is always getting updated every time there is a sale. Right now it's the winter sale. Um, you can see the the price is pretty well here and the biggest discount. And of course, you can um, decide what you want to see. Like you can sort out the filter. It's super, super useful. That reminded me that now I have another thing that's a pressing on my mind. I'd write about it in discourse in time. I'm not comfortable talking about it here. Please don't worry about this. Yeah. If you're not feeling comfortable about talking about that, don't do it over the don't do it over the um, over Twitch. I would I would keep those things uh, more or less uh, private here. If just do do whatever you feel comfortable with. That's I think that's the most important part. Exactly. And no or, and no privacy leaks. I mean no uh, personal data. That's something I'm very very um yeah. I'm I'm let's say I'm I'm putting a lot of effort for keeping all this data data safe and I don't want that anyone is getting trouble with us so that's very important to me um where were we <laughs> we were playing uh this beautiful game and then and I figured out the music changed a bit I think this is a new scenery here uh-huh a new butterfly oh this is looking uh, looking icy thin wing oopsa Let's see, Finwing, Toucan Beak Butterfly. Oh, we're halfway through with the butterflies. Okay. And Pale Blue Finwing. Oh, it's a beautiful, very colorful game. I like this a lot. <laughs> Boxnick is kind of the same. Boxnick is also very, very colorful. Oh, a glowing flower again. Oh! The, the... 
Bird monkey. <gasps> More birds. I think we have to climb up this tree again. So that was the second section, I guess. This one is not good for my back. <laughs> I'm so sorry, dudes, but I want you to save money. I want you to save money. <laughs> it is there to save money, but I also understand um, <laughs> that you want to spend money to get good games. But sometimes you're finding games under five euro and you never heard of it. And then it's looking super interesting, right? Yeah, um, in my opinion, you're not seeing these kind of stuff often over, over the original website, over the Steam website. It's not anything Steam account password level private. No, it's it's also when people are saying, I think when they are, I think it was you you are you're not allowed to be on the 13, for example, um, then you are officially not allowed to be on Twitch, and I also need to react to that. Um, also, people sometimes are leaking their places where they're living, and there might be a small place, and I don't want that people are getting doxxed or, um, <laughs> you know, there are some stalkers as well, and. I, I made horrible experience with stalkers, so I don't want that any one of you is experienced this, to be honest. Um, so you always need to pay attention, not pity, yeah, of course, we all need to pay attention, but um, beware where you're sharing your information, your private information, even if it's just your name and where you're living. Can get uh, uh, to a lot of information, I guess. It's true too, but maybe I should go through my own Steam account as well. There are. <gasps> 1,428 games. Damn, and I thought I'm a game collector. I got, uh, I'm going to 800 games now. Oh my god, dudes, that's crazy. That's nice, though. I think, I think, actually, you, you are having game for many, many years if you want to play all of them. <laughs> Damn, dudes, you're also a game collector. That's nice. That's super nice. Also, someone who's supporting the devs done. That's good. Uh, there's the purple. Whip. Can you fly again, cutie? Wait, this is also new. Well, this could be a nice page. Oh, with the purple inside, not inside in the background. Oh, yeah. Is this the banana bird? <laughs> it is the banana toucan. Oh, they were so. S <gasps> there you go. Don't fly away. Oh my god, they're looking so majestic. Look at that. So cute. I want to go closer. And I need a, I need a letter. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Your fly also is so cute. Oh my god, this game is making me smile. Banana peel toucan. I'm glad I got them, but I think I'm going to take this as my main picture. I like to, I like to see them more zoomed in. Anything else? I'm still missing lo so many bucks, I think. I think the problem is also they're, <laughs> they're a bit too small. I might miss them. Oh, this is a good photo, right? I like this one. A legendary dragon burp. <laughs> it's a super cute, cu super cute one. Banana toucan. Some people are just so creative. I'm hearing some animals here. I think. What's this? Oh, are you see? Oh my God! It's just down here. It's a bug. Grasshopper. <laughs> What's <are> reacting? <laughs> They're also humming, like just like me. Let me see. I'll take the other one though. Is that is main humming melach malachit malachit. Oh God, malachite. In German, it's Malachit. <laughs> Grasshopper. Uh. <laughs> hello, dear Fox. Hello, hello. Welcome to the stream. You have 34, 34 Steam games. That's okay. I'm pretty sure you played all of them, right? Never dox yourself. Never give information that could be used for security questions. Yep. It's very important. Um, <laughs> this is also one of my rules. If you're scrolling down, then you can also see it's... Uh, I'm having this since day one, actually. I'm having this since day one. Yeah, bad experience is uh, making you think of this way. But yeah, I I don't want that. This is all of this is happening to you guys. Uh, let me see. Oh, 
Oh no, I don't want to take a selfie. You are doing the noise, right? No. No, this is something else here. Oh, what's this? Oh, there's also another one. Oh, wow. This is even sparkling. Looking like a potion. <laughs> Longhorn beetle. Nice. Gonna head out, Burbles. Have good, uh, have a good stream. More. Enjoy your time. Thank you, Tatami. Thank you so much again for tier three. Thank you so much again. I hope you're doing better. I hope you're doing better. I I remember you said to me that you got very sick, and I hope you're doing better now. <laughs> Thank you so so much for tuning in. Speaking of doxing, my sister got me a cool, glowy light up sign with my epic gamer name on it, which is absolutely lovely. But how did you find out my gamer name? Who leaked? <laughs> uh, good question, Josh. She's not a gamer, I assume, right? Damn, your sister... Your sister knows how to do some detective work. Or is it also the same? Like, is it also Josh? I think you can't find easier people over Epic, to be honest. It's a bit harder over Steam. Kind of played everything. It's much open world and long games. Yeah, well, well that's good. That's good. I mean, what are you going to do if you're, if you're having 1,000 games and you're not playing them? It's kind of waste. Games are there to be played. Same with books. Books are there to be... They, you should read books. And you should, you should play the games you're buying. <laughs> Did you ever play Potion Craft uh, again? Or did you stop after that one uh, stream? Um, I played a bit. I played a bit. I was thinking about streaming it again, again, to be honest. That was super chill, right? Yeah, we can also do this next week, to be honest. Um, because I don't have any big releases anymore. I don't think so. So right now I'm working a bit on my, my backlog. Oh, I, I, I didn't finish Potion Craft yet. I didn't do that. She's like Batman. I've never told her, Jess. Huh. Did you ask her? You should ask her, Josh. How, did she, how could she find out? I'm also curious now. Some detective work. Damn. <laughs> Fortune Craft is solid, yes. And game is a bit of a grind, though. Oh, no, really? I think we have six hours so far. Or is, let's say seven to eight hours maximum. I'm not sure if the grind starts already there, but... <clears throat> I wouldn't mind. I, I wouldn't mind to make one or two streams again, just to, to chill out. Oh, something new! Oh, what, what? 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 What's new? This tree? Wait, what? All plants, green thumb achievement, branded barnacle mush. Oh, oh! I found a mushroom. Wait a sec. Oh no, no, no! I want to run. Run, Mimi. There's a mushroom. Of course. <laughs> well. Da, 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 da. Wait, that, that melody reminds me of Mario. When you're entering the castle. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is a better picture of the mushrooms, right? I think we got all the mushrooms now. Uh, not the mushrooms, but the plants. Since we got the achievement, Green Thump. Capture all unique vegetation photos in this singing uh, jungle. Nice, we got it. I said it's me this way. Uh, the the grind starts at chapter eight to nine ish. Okay, um, I think I'm at chapter five. I think it was five. Yeah, I wanted to craft one of. Oh, what was the second big potion? Um, yeah, that's the one I was working on slowly, but then uh, I I kind of stopped playing because of the other releases I wanted to to play as well. But that's always a game you can come uh, come back and chill. It's not like it's it needs. Uh, I need to remember huge gameplay. <laughs> it was very important to me that I've kind of finished Black Tail first. Okay, those are all the burbles we took pictures of. Uh huh. And then, oh, this one, right? Sparking lily, li lamp lily. Ding, 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 ding. 
There you go. Ooh. But I think I'm missing a bird. What is this? Did you did it? Or is it just in the background? I think I spent six to seven hours. Com <gasps> but I did too. <laughs> six to seven hours. Ooh, I, I want. I'm, I really wonder what makes it so grindy. I try to imagine of that. I'm always pressing shift because I'm thinking I could just run faster with that. <laughs> you see? I did it again. Out of this tree. Maybe getting a better view. Dun, 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 dun. And now it also makes sense that you can't uh, use your camera here. That would be a bit OP. It's giving a good view. But what is the sound? Or is this coming from here? Duh. No, look at those burbles! They're chilling here! Are you doing this, Noesis? Oh my god, they're so sweet! What's this? It's another bird, right? D it's a dove! Oh, hibiscus plumped dove! Oh. Oh my god, my, my heart is getting warmed up insanely because I'm seeing birds. <laughs> That's sweet. Oh, wait, wait. I didn't want to do this. I want to take a picture of this. Oh, that's a tear. Oh, okay. Okay, Mimi. GR kids. It's the popularity level. Oh, of course. I forgot about this one. For chapter 10, it's going from level 11 to 50. Oh, that's a huge step. It's about 3,500 points total, and you get 45 points on average per client. Oh, wow, this is a lot of grind. Ooh, that's going to take uh, <laughs> some some evenings done. But you could also hmm, just put something on on the second screen. Just, uh, I don't know, Netflix, Disney, whatever. And then uh, just do this uh, while watching something, right? That sounds because it sounds very grindy. I'm not a huge fan of grindy games, by the way. Um, just a little warning. I played Diablo, but I only played the main story. I was like, yeah, okay, I don't, I don't need to grind all the rest. That's kind of pointless to me. But I always enjoyed the, the story. Oh, a green one. I wonder what the name here is. I'm also flexing here. Oh, emerald birdwing butterfly. Mm -hmm. They know what Mimi likes. <laughs> <laughs> I Fox, thank you so much for the 100 bits. Quack. <laughs> thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Merry Christmas to you, by the way, and happy holidays. I forgot to say this to you. Thank you so, so much for the bits. To be fair, there's no real reason to, to get to popularity level 15 unless you want to absolutely complete everything. <laughs> um, I'm an achievement hunter, kind of. Yeah, I will probably <laughs> try to get that. But from level 11 to 15, that's a huge step. Yeah, I, I don't think you... Yeah, most games, they are. If you are done with the story, then it, it's fine. But like, if you want to get the rest of the achievements done, you need to work for it a bit. As long as you're enjoying yourself, that's the most important part. If you're not, doing, if you're not enjoying it, then don't make it. Don't do it. I, I figured out there, also, there were also some very, very grindy achievements i was like nope i'm not gonna do that that's not worth it well prepare to get 40 hours in potion crowd that well that's good that's good then you're getting lots of uh, hours uh, while playing this game i didn't expect this to be honest that's super nice then i like this kind of games anyway <laughs> so this is my emerald birdwing butterfly it's getting better now i want to get a better picture of the hibiscus plume doll dove Oh, there you go. Oh, look at those beauties. <laughs> those are... <b> <laughs> Dude, they are literally... Un they're <laughs> hanging like bananas there. Oh my god, this is so cute. <laughs> yeah, okay, I need to take a picture of this. Oh my god, this is too cute. My heart is melting. My heart is just melting. 
Actually, I need to take a picture for my Steam as well this because it's too it's just too cute. <laughs> okay, this might be a bit loud. I'm so sorry, but I need to do this. You probably heard this, right? It's too cute. I kind of <laughs> fell in love with this one. <laughs> There's two concept of it. I agree. I agree. They're so sweet here. Oh, wait. I can also climb this one. But let me... Oh, okay. No, no, no. no. I want to go here first. Those banana birds are so sweet. <laughs> I think we need to go up here anyway. Wow, look at them. <laughs> oh! That's a better picture, right? <laughs> oh! They're all reminding me of Zazu. Well, I kind of want to see Zazu now. I miss my birds. I'm going to take a better picture. Um, this one was good. Right? Oh, this one is even better because the the music sheet here. Um, not the sheet, but the Musiknote in German. <laughs> you can just... Uh, it's right here. Not in, It's not in the, in the face of the purple. All right. I like this one. Great. Sounds a boy. <laughs> da, 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 da. Yeah, I need to figure out how to do this with the uh, the cat cell monkeys. How many achievements are here? Thirty one achievements. What? Damn, there are so many achievements for this game. And I thought it's a small game. Uh, yeah, that's probably also one of those games. Like th you're gonna you. You're gonna probably take like two or three hours to get the pictures or to be done with the main story, but to get all the achievements, that's probably gonna take a bit more time for the completionist. Oh no, this is getting complicated. Which way should I go now? Where did that gliding binky go? It must be around here somewhere. I think I missed a moment, maybe. Journal. Oh, uh, let me see. I need to find them um, while gliding, singing, dancing. I'm missing three box, two butterflies, and two birds. Mm -hmm. I think I missed a bug. So this is just basic Pokemon Snap, but with cute animals. Yeah, I agree. I agree. Uh, I agree. Um, did you play Penko Park? That's also a super nice game. But... Um, I'm glad I can choose my own path here. Uh, there is no wagon or car I'm sitting in and um, I'm not feeling pressured. I can just hang out here and I'm not scaring things away. So I think this is even more chill. But yeah, I think this is where, uh, I agree, this is where the inspiration is probably coming from. Those photography games are kind of popping up lately. <laughs> Okay, um, let's go this way. What are these nests? Oh, those binky nests? But where are the binkies? Probably sliding down. I wonder if I can coax them down with my whistle. <laughs> what does this music remind me of? It's probably one specific instrument. Under the sea. Under the sea. Is it also called xylophone? Like a mamba? Maybe it's a mamba. It does is the expert here. He probably knows why it sounds similar. He got better ears. <laughs> um, I think I'm gonna whistle now. Oh! What's gonna happen now? <gasps> oh wow, there's so many! I wish I could just get a feather. Oh, they're all sitting here now. Do they have babies? I think those are little babies. Oh, Saki, hi! Welcome to the stream. I'm still waiting for the game birding simulator. Bird photograph. <laughs> what 
be the perfect game, right? That would be the absolute perfect game. I wish I could do this in real life, but I'm not patient enough and I'm also not having time enough to do that. That would be the perfect game. Unfortunately, I don't know much about wild birds. I really want to learn more. I think that would be also a very educative stream. That would fit so much to me. Hi, Sagi. Welcome to the stream. It's good to see you. Those fancy feathers. Oh, they're kind of copying me now. Or I'm just imagining this. Da, 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 da. A natural shots. Oh, okay. So one thing is also done, right? And then inside the journal should be. No, oh no, it's okay. Never mind. It's not here. Uh, how can I get a picture without them? Somebody dancing. <laughs> This one is kind of jumping a bit. I'm not sure if this is counting as the dancing. I would say yes. Some people are jumping while dancing. No, it's... Mm -mm. No, I want to take this. No, this is going to stay as my main picture. But I think this is not counting as dancing. No. Then it must be very, very special to see them dancing, right? What's this flower again? Oops, uh. I should have taken a picture of the of the banana birds with me as a selfie. Hi, chaos! Hello, welcome to the stream. How are you doing today? Should we just go around? Because we can go there. And there's also no slide. Wait, I can also go here. Oh no, so many possibilities! Wait, they're flying! I found them flying! Wait, there's so many birds! I want to kiss all the beaks, man! <laughs> Looking like a bit scared. No, don't fly away. Wait. Imagine all the beaks you could kiss. Oh, I love the bird smell. <laughs> I'm a crazy bird lady. Many people jump while they are dancing. Yeah. yeah, I mean, it's also some kind of movement. Oh, there are so many butterflies here. Oh, they're looking fancy. With lots of eyes. Also kind of creepy. Buck eye captured. Orchid buck eye. <laughs> Leaf winged parrot and wine tailed tanager. I was about to say teenager. <laughs> Humongous trees in open world games. H open world games are kind of scaring me. <laughs> because they're too big. Wait, what is this burble? <gasps> Oh my god! Look at this! Look at this! It's dancing. Oh, cutie. Looking like a mango a bit, right? A mango bird. <laughs> so cute. That means we're only missing one burble. The leaf winged carrot. <laughs> not a carrot! Oh no! It's not a carrot. Imagine I'm taking a picture of a carrot. I mean, we could uh, we could have done this yesterday in uh, in Aka. By the way, tomorrow there's gonna be um, a little additional video on YouTube with Aka um, around 4 p.m. CET. I played a bit further, and um, I did other quests. Plus, I did the card game again. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so if people are interested or missing my voice tomorrow, you can also you can also um, check out the, the new witch tomorrow, the additional one. I was recording a bit today. Looks like a bit uh, looks like a mango flavored bird, <laughs> right? I'm not sure if it's flavored though. <laughs> Probably not, but it's looking like a kid mom <laughs> mango. Oh, I love mangoes. 
Guys, this tree is humongous. Oh, Pan, this tree is so big. Wait, something is new. Oh, this is a bug I don't know yet. By accident. Emerald leaf bug. Oh, fancy. Is that a flower on the booty? Oopsa. <laughs> I think so. Bunny eared emerald leaf bug. Bunny. <laughs> it is bunny eared. That's so creative. There's so much creativity in this game. Almost get everything. Damn, we're good, chat. We're very good. Do we like this picture more or this one? No, this is better. Even though it's uh, having some kind of gray filter here. Hmm. Confirm bunny ears make bugs cute. <laughs> For sure. To be honest, everything about bunnies are so cute. That's why I got bunnies as well. I'm also missing my bunnies. I wish this branch wouldn't be just in the middle. Well, that would be a good picture then, right? Oh, hoo -hoo. Okay, um... Should we just go this way? It's looking like the right pathway. I don't like that. I want to go the wrong way first. <laughs> Are you guys also thinking this? Okay, before I'm following the right pathway, I'm going to do as much as possible on the other... the other traces. Oh! It's looking like a firebug. It's dangerous. Ba, ba, ba. Topaz. Reno beetle. That means only one missing. Giant. A snail. A snail. But I don't think we saw a snail. Hopefully soon. Wait a sec. Where are we? I think everything is connected here. We had this, right? Wait a second. This looks familiar. No. <laughs> oh, I got two different kind of burbles. Where, where are they? I want to take a selfie. Okay, and... <gasps> well, this is a good picture. <laughs> this is such a good picture. I like this one. Wait, I can also go a bit higher. Now, this was perfect, right? No, I can take another one. Can you look to the right side again? Go, girl. She's just shocked. <gasps> Look what I found. <gasps> no! Oh no! She just moved their eyes. I'm gonna wait until she moves, the, moves their eyes. Looking like looking at the birds. Do it again. Hello? Gotta love those birds. The banana ones. And mango. There you go. Oh, this is a good picture. I like this one. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I take so many. <laughs> That's nice. I'm going to keep this one. We're going to delete the rest. Oh, no. <laughs> delete. No. I can't click. Yes, I want to delete this one. Also that one. And this one. Boom, boom, boom. Does it mean... You only can take uh, 12 pictures and then that's it. Hmm. Oh, hi, people. Merry Christmas and happy holidays to you. How was your Christmas? It was pretty good. It was pretty much only yesterday. Um, I spent some time with Nubi's family and today I was just chilling. So Christmas is pretty much over. <laughs> How was yours? How are you doing? I'm searching for a snail. Oh wow, there was did you see how they were flying? Monkey birds. Do it again. Oi! <laughs> Almost landing on my hat. Um where do we have to go? I, I'm lost. Wait, we were here, right? Oh my god, this tree. Good thing is you can't fall down. That would annoy me a lot. Okay, no more plants though. Oh! These binky, binkies are socializing by singing to each other. If I could 
just mimic their voices, I might be able to bring one closer to me. Better listen to their song closely. I don't want to offend them. I assume I just have to press the button Q. Oh, there's a melody coming over there. Do you like this one? I can't see anything. I'm going to get a uh, D&D star, I said. I don't know how to play, but I want to know how to. Oh, there are probably a lot of tutorials on YouTube. I'm wishing you lots of fun with that. That sounds like super fun. That sounds like super fun, yeah. It's pretty cool, uh, indeed. Like some miniatures or a dice set or some books. Maybe all of that. <laughs> a starter set. Oh, you can do so much there. That's super nice. How do we make this? Uh, how is the journal looking like? Singing. It, it is singing right now, but behind the bush. So singing and dancing. And then one bug, uh, one picture of a bug, butterfly and birds. You like what you hear? It doesn't want to. I'm pretty sure I need to take a picture here, right? I don't think there is something in the background. Oh, wait a second. But it's not singing. This one is not singing, only this one. Wait a, wait a second, it was different this time. Maybe I really need to play the right melody? <laughs> I feel stupid for doing that. The real book is like 31 pages. Some uh, have pictures, some uh, don't. A book, pre-made character sheets and dice. So it is actually a real, uh, real nice star I said. I'm wishing you lots of fun with this, people. Lots of, lots of fun. I don't know how to lure this uh, singing one. Maybe this way. Oi! Oi! Yeah, this is probably going to another... Oi! What am I doing? Oh, this is probably the other way. Mm -hmm, the right way. This is the how to do the progress. It needs to jump in front of me, otherwise it doesn't count. No, I, nothing is happening here. Damn it. Huh. Gliding. That's what we got. Natural shots. It's counting as natural shot. Okay, oh, I'm gonna delete this one. Oh, there's so many. Oops. <laughs> I took a lot of pictures, huh? Lots of pictures. It's singing. I'm pretty sure it's here. I just think you had to... Oh my god, I need a better picture now. 
I think you had to, you just had to do it way more often. And then the right one, the timing? I'm not sure. <laughs> Singing behavior captured. I'm glad it worked out. I was pretty sure it was here. Singing. So now we need to see them dancing. Hope we can see this now. I think I'm gonna go uh, deep rocking for a moment before going to bed. Good night, all of you. Good night and have fun. Okay, let's go around. I also kind of I have this itch to play ahead in time again. <laughs> It's, oh god, I love this game. I actually love this game so much. Were we here before? No, I can't remember going, doing this. Is something inside? Oh, this looks so nice though. It also creeped me out in real life. <laughs> I mean, if bugs would look pretty like this, that would be nice. They're always not always like that. <laughs> I want to see snails. Oh, they're helping me with the bridges. That's good. Finch. Oh, what are you doing here? Which one is my... Oh, wait a second. The dancing one. What, what am I doing? I'm taking pictures of feathers. <laughs> Kiss indeed. You guys are cute. <laughs> so what was this here? Isn't this kind of sus? Am I going back? No, that's a new way. What happened to the b birds? Monkey. I want to see you dance. Wait, something is in your... Well, this is a, another behavior we had already, right at the beginning. What's on the left side? Because it's looking like you can drop down here, right? Can you go up again? I'm still missing a bird. I really don't want to miss a bird. I think this is where the main story goes. Okay, let me let me quickly go to the left side then. Is something new to your left? Uh, I'll check it out. Thank you. I'll check it out. Try not to forget. Uh, wait, this is where it came from. That's the gliding one. And you were going down? Okay. Mm -hmm. Oops. Uh, oh, no. <laughs> I think they're going to dance down there. Might be the major dance. <laughs> we'll see. Okay, we already had those bugs done. There's only one way to go. Hey, mango, mango birds. One way to go, which is only down. Oh, look at the lights here. <laughs> Isn't this even better? I'm gonna take this. Some kind of a gray filter here. I'm not gonna delete it, but I think that's just better. Same with this. It set as main. I'm gonna have a nice uh, photo album. Courtship dance, okay. 
it's called. Then, um, that could be also a better picture here. Gi the, the giant snail. Swallowtail, pink painted. Oh, I don't think I missed this one. I think in, it's probably here somewhere. Would be, the colors are too, too vibrant, I think. And leaf winged parents. Butterfly. Leaf winged. Oh, this probably, maybe I missed the birds. Because everything is some kind of looking like a, a leaf. Oh, I'm gonna take this as main. Oh, wait, what is this? Blue flower. <laughs> oh, wait, that was the bird monkey. Okay. Uh, oh, this is new. Oh, this is the, the burble. Oh my god. Oh, the cute burble. <gasps> oh, this is super cute. Fruit. <laughs> Okay, the achievement called Fruit Basket. <laughs> Capture all bird photos in the single in this singing jungle. Oh wow, this is very sweet. <laughs> so the birds are done. I'm glad I we didn't miss the birds at least. That means um only the pink painted spellow tail. And I, I hope they're very obvious to see. I really hope so. Looks like southern Leo. Trust me, when one of the one of the birds is uh, flexing, the other one is also doing this. It's like they're doing everything together. Uh, when they're snacking, they're snacking together. When they're sleeping, they're doing this together. When they're nibbling on their on their their toys, they're doing this together as well. This is why you should definitely keep birds together. Uh, if you're asking yourself, should I have only one bird, or or just in general, should I have one? of each kind it's like just look how they're living in real life are they, do they have a swarm where they're having uh, where they're living or do they have a group they're living with um then you can see this is most of the time answering your question mm. it's dehydrated chat they are also brothers in spirit <laughs> even though they hate each other but i think <laughs> that's very normal right <laughs> Sometimes it's very normal. It's the special bond. I kind of want to take a better picture of the, the ruby beetle because at the beginning I, I, I was scared of scaring them away. This one is so much better. There you can see the ruby at least better. Uh, I'm going to replace this one. Isn't this better? Right? Super complimentary. I like this one a lot. Um, now the question is this way. I'm still searching for this butterfly. I'm so scared of missing it. <gasps> oh my god, they're a baby cockapo! Oh my god, they're baby cockapos! That's super cute! Probably not go that so close to, to the animals in wildlife. They would also just fly away. Big bug. The good thing is, if you missed some of the animals or plants, they are repeating. They are not forever lost. <laughs> this is also the, the the jumping one. The grasshopper. Oh, this little guy is trying to attract the girl, but he's just not impressive enough. I had a feeling. I had a feeling. Maybe I can be his wingman and help him out. I think Grandpa said something about binky courtship and lights in the journal. Okay, so I'm, I'm taking a picture of that. Captured. How can I help you though? Oh, of course, with a flower. But I think I... Oopsa. I need to do this. Or, nah, that's something different. Oh. It would be rude to wake it. <gasps> oh, the snail! 
This oh my god, that's a giant snail. This is the last one. So cute. Wow, this is so nice. All gem box. Not the average jewel beetle <laughs> achievement. <laughs> Capture all gem box photo in the singing jungle. So beautiful. But still the butterfly is missing. Then we got almost everything. I'm gonna take the family, of course. That is mean. I can't delete bird pictures. <laughs> Some uh, people would keep a snail like that as a pet, of course. For sure. I mean, I wouldn't mind that. Even though, dude, imagine what they're eating, to be honest. They must eat lots of vegetables. What's so magical about this? I think that's the puzzle we need to do here. <gasps> what? Pick it up. Uh, I think I'm gonna place it here. I think that's the puzzle part. Drop. Wow. I did it! I better grab a photo of the happy couple. Oh! Look at this dance! <laughs> a dancing behavior! All monkey business achievement! <laughs> I mean, the reason why animals are dancing is pretty much that's why. So where am I going to get um, the pink butterflies? <laughs> Just like Gary. What's happening here? Praise the snail overlords! <laughs> Gary, one of my favorite characters actually. <laughs> Looking so cute. I am a bit worried that we're missing mm, the last picture. I'm a bit worried about that. <laughs> Yeah, all butterflies. But I want to 100% complete. 100% complete this. Wait, it's this here. I think it's right in front of me. I never saw those before. <gasps> and I just scared it away. Wait, there's in front of... Oh my god, we got 100%! Easy clamp. I had a feeling. Jungle objectives done. Fluttered by and jungle explore achievements. Well, I like it when you're getting lots of achievements. Congratulations! You've unlocked some extras. Go to the main menu to view them. So we're done here? Oh! That was the magical animal we saw right at the beginning. Thank you so much to the Lord people. Thank you. I appreciate it. I wanted to take a picture. No, I forgot to take a picture. And now? Objective done. Da, 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 da. It, was, was, it was very unsatisfying yesterday to not seeing any credits. Please, oh, I need credits. <laughs> I want to I wanna listen to a nice song in the end. So is... Wait a second. There's a temple. Why is this reminding me of World of Warcraft? <laughs> there is a dungeon which is looking kind of similar. And on the, the platform you're fighting here. It always ends up with World of Warcraft. Very pretty artwork. I, I agree, yeah. I agree. A Duncan Temple? I think so as well. Best credits gave of... Uh, grave of the Firefly. Yeah. It was so good that I actually cried. Oh my god. I really couldn't hold my tears anymore. <laughs> it was a really good movie. I'm glad we watched it. Soul Farah? Maybe, huh? I forgot the names, but they were s some kind of uh, similar looking one. 
Also in Cataclysm, there was a whole dungeon in in the jungle as well. What was that, by the way? It was huge. It was sound like like a lion or a tiger or something. So group, the last one is. Re uh, I remember this one actually. Where'd all the binkies go? Were they scared of it too? Can't be good. And why is my backpack vibrating? Now we have to find now Elden Ring boss fight with, with four faces or something. <laughs> Imagine! The gem is glowing. i never seen it do that before. I've got to keep going and figure out what all this means. I think we're bringing the magic back again. You can still take pictures if you want to. It's a super nice landscape as well. Oh, I like this one. Instead of following <laughs> the 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 sign, I'm just taking pictures. But let me take some pictures. You mean Tilgoro when we're with Kata, they make it into a dungeon? Um, I'm not sure. I have got some blurry mem uh, memories, but there was definitely also. I'm not. I'm not even sure if that was the same dungeon. So Gorup, let me actually let me quickly Google that. You are the expert here. You're probably right. Um, oh, I play this so often. Exactly, exactly. It's this temple in the middle. Oh my god, the memories. Yeah, I was talking about Silk Group. <laughs> yup. Funny. That's funny. I remember there was one boss, which was you could do this alone as, as a death knight. You could tank this alone and do the damage. It took several years, but it was possible. And I always thought this is so broken. Well, the, at the beginning, people were <laughs> people were noobs. And <laughs> it was, yeah. <laughs> I also died a few times. I admit it. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Thog. It was it was actually Zulgorub. Or Zul Zulgorub. I had no idea how to pronounce that. You can do most of the things so that's so unfair. That's so unfair. Over buff tanks. <laughs> Just like in Overwatch. So what are we doing here? What was this noise? Why am I never taking a picture of that? <gasps> there it is again. Because I didn't see it this time. But that's also a nice picture here. A dear thing keeps showing up around the island. Is it following me or am I following it? I think it's both kind of. This is also beautiful. You can take so many screenshots. I like how the butterflies are sitting here as well. I like this one as well. <laughs> but I don't want to have it captured uh, for the battle, but uh, better <laughs> for the butterflies. I, mean, I want to have this as a landscape. Isn't this beautiful? Oh, I need to take need to take lots of screen capture later on. I want to save this over Steam. Oh, you can look under the map just a bit. <laughs> I did this so often just to see when you can go. I don't know when you didn't have a key or whatever. I was just looking like this. Uh huh. What's on the other side? <laughs> kind of cheating. If you can do this, of course. Oh, a cave with crystals. Uh huh. Are you ready to adventure onwards? You will not be able to return to this area for a while. Well, that's, uh, that's good that you're getting a warning here, a point of no return. I'm ready. I played Blood EK2 Legion and I played with a second tank mate, Hearthstone, on the side because we didn't die. It's crazy to me. As a DPS player, that's so unfair. <laughs> so, so unfair. 
-hmm. All right. Oh, this is also looking nice. So magical. Big shrooms. Wait, what? <gasps> oh, that's the second. That's the second one. The second page. Wait, what's this? Wait a second. I need to need to check out my book now. So we get a second page of the the plants. I forgot about that. Yeah. The flora. No, never mind. No, it's here. Hey. Fungal amphibians, new dart frog. <gasps> Toads and frogs. Oh, oh my god, there's a spider as well. I was reading Black Opa. No, it's Opal. Celestial winged bats. Bats as well. Guys, suddenly there is so much more content. they li like the double amount. I <laughs> have no idea. But yeah, I'm not happy about the spider section. I hope they're not too disgusting. They're saying it's bugs, but yeah. There's one spider. Pond skater, I'm I'm sure that's also gonna trigger me, but we'll we're we're gonna survive. Hopefully. Um more and more uh, flowers as, as well. So, oh, wow, I thought about just taking a picture of the <laughs> of the um of the landscape. Well, near to toadstool. I'm I'm pretty sure I would just destroy this toad. But just by sitting on it. Wait, what happened to a journal then? This seems like a bug here. No. You see the the page here? Objective photos. All plans. One of ten. Okay, interesting. Interesting. That's also new. Glowing trumpets. Oh, so many new things. What's this? <gasps> uh, wh what is this stuff? <laughs> of course, glowing flowers would drop glowing pollen. Does it ride in with the rest of the plants? <laughs> oh! Damn, I'm also glowing. Firefly? There is a firefly here? Where? Maybe on the other side. Seems like a little buggy to me. <laughs> I look great with the colors. Rip it. Oh, probably those, right? Yeah. Aura quartz uh, firefly. Oh, this is looking amazing. I like this. I like this place. New objectives. It seems these strange friends like my new shining style. What do they think I'm a flower with this pollen on me? It glows otherworldly. What other mysterious beings might I find here? Can I take a picture? Oh! <laughs> Wait, there's slowly just... Oh my god, this is so many. Okay, this is better. Blizzard simply cannot balance any of their games, and Legion Blood DK was simply indestructible, even PvP. Yeah. I mean, it always felt like, I'm gonna be honest, it always felt like Death Knights are some kind of their favorite class. But things are changing a lot. Blizzard was never known for <laughs> for proper balancing. It also never changed with the, with the watch, to be honest. Where's Pikachu? <laughs> I think we had some kind of Pikachus with the birds earlier. Especially the banana um, toucan. It <laughs> was so sweet to see. I'm <laughs> looking so fancy. That's also new. Blossom tree. Oh, they're leaving me again. Should I follow them? No. 
Oh, more things are glowing. <gasps> there are other birds! What's this? <gasps> oh, toads! Ribbit. <laughs> Now it's going to be a chunker. I guess we're going to follow this way, right? Oh. Ooh, everything here is so connected. The fireflies help the tree drop its fruits, which makes the frog glow after it eats it. <laughs> I wonder if that fruit would make me grow a glow. <laughs> but it's probably not the best idea to eat weird glow magic fruit. I'll stick with the trail mix. I think that's a good idea. Monks were also very strong, but I was never a fan of the class. Same, because they rolled around too much for me. <laughs> Damn it. I also d didn't like the play style. I also didn't like it. I remember I even tried the monks in, in Heroes of the Storm, and I... Nope. It was too much jumping around. That's not my play style. Not at all. I agree with you. <gasps> oh, it's this little boy. Oh my god, don't you think he, this is so cute looking? Bullfrog? They're actually super big. They're so cute. Let me different noises. What a puppy. Oh, they're also sitting there. Oh? No, that's nothing new. I feel it's so small here. What's new? Something here. I lost it by zooming in. A gleaming lotus. Oh. A cat tail. Lost just cat Oh, those ones. Okay. Let's check our book. Um, we're almost done with the flora, actually. Quickly going here. Oh, so I take a picture of those small things. Then it's probably this one is better. So I know what, what this is. It's also nice. Dun, 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 dun. But you're not getting better points here, not like in Pokemon Snap. Rule of thumb, you can't eat anything at least. <laughs> at least once. <laughs> I guess so. <laughs> I mean, it's probably super, super useful if you are collecting mushrooms. But I think you need to be experienced with that. I think you can also eat lots of mushrooms which are not good for you. I don't want to get poisoned because, yeah, because I'm thinking, oh, this one is looking similar like the other one. I'm actually not experienced, actually not experienced at all with mushrooms. Are you guys, are you guys experienced with that? I have no idea about when I'm seeing, uh, I don't know, when I'm seeing leaves of trees. I'm just like, I have no idea what tree this is. To my defense, I'm a city girl. <laughs> I grew up in the city, so um. It was always ca kind of hard for me. What a, what a shitty... What a bad to uh, apologize. <laughs> I mean, explanation. But it's actually true. I like this one. Learning which mushrooms are safe to eat seems like a lot of fun to learn. I agree, but I would be still scared. Even experienced people can do this mistake. And that's the scary part about it. City girl. <laughs> Shame. <laughs> Josh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I wish... I also wish I would have grown up uh, on the countryside. But my, my parents couldn't afford it. <gasps> oh, dear Latin Striker, thank you so much again for the raid. Now, that's insanely kind. That's very kind. You already raided us yesterday. Thank you so much for trusting me, your community, again. Thank you. That's very, very kind. I hope you're doing well and you had a great stream. Hello, Raiders. And you played some Parasite Eve 2. How was it? Oh, Legend Striker, thank you. Oh, thank you so much. Hi, <laughs> hi, hi. No, hi. Thank you. Thank you so much for the sub. Thank you. That's... I never say this often, but that's very, very kind and generous. 
Thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> it's very kind. So I, I hope you had a good stream. How was your stream? But I don't even know if you are allowed to freshly pick things like that in Germany. I think you are allowed to, but <laughs> I am not sure. I think you can pick up mushrooms, but you actually are right. You are not allowed to pick up a lot of plants because they are protected. I mean, there are also a lot of areas in Germany, which is um, a protected area. You are not even allowed to. You're not even, I mean, you, you can walk there on, on specific pathways, but um, I think it's very re restricted. I, I saw a lot of places like this and you're not allowed to pick up the, you're not even allowed to pick up a flower or whatever. Just a little plant. I hope I'm pronouncing your name right. Sylvite? Sylvite, I think. This sounds kind of right. <laughs> Hi there. Welcome with the raid. How are you doing? You deserve it. Oh, that's so kind. <laughs> you killed a monster, big one. Like, homongous. Nice. Very nice. That sounds like you did a huge progress done. I'm glad. Oh, fun it. Merry Christmas and a happy holidays. No, I'm wishing the same to you as well. Merry Christmas and happy holidays. Thank you. Thank you so much. You got it right? <laughs> it's good. I don't want to mess up the names. Sometimes uh, it's quite hard, but when you're, when you're, once you're reading it out, then you're understanding. Ah, okay, it's pronounced like that. Thank you for asking. Of course. It's that time of a year again. I got to sleep on the sofa because I have a... Oh, no! Oh no, so sick. I'm so sorry to hear. <laughs> but hi, welcome to the stream. Netherlands has the same thing. It's only allowed to pick one gram of something over there. And more is considered poaching. Oh damn, okay. Good to know, 100 gram. The good thing is I'm never doing this anyway. Uh, I'm, ne I'm never doing this anyway. I would not recommend going to a restricted uh, area and pick up anything, to be honest. Um, I have also no feeling like what is 100 gram. It's quite hard to say. <laughs> so I'm, I'm not doing this anyway. You, I'm always thinking if you are ripping off a grass or a flower, like a plant, it's uh, it takes so long to, to grow, you know? What are you going to do with this? Um, <laughs> it's going to, yeah, you're going to put it into water and then it's gone. This is why I don't like uh, flowers, which are cut. Like those, like bouquets. I, I just... If you want to give me flowers, just give me the root of the flower. <laughs> so it's living longer. We're all having something from that. Like, I, I don't like bouquets. Well, like, those are dead flowers, basically. I might think very radical here. <laughs> but, yeah, I would not enjoy that. Even though it's it meant well, you know? I saw something new. This one is new. Oh, okay, she's jumping automatically here. 100 gram is, <laughs> oh yeah, <laughs> you don't say, 0 0.1 kilogram, <laughs> I guess so. <laughs> this one, what is this exactly? Oh, it's a frog. Oh, the frog is hiding. The frog is hiding. Oh, this is also new. Oh, I got so many impressions. Wait, that's a bat. I'm actually scared of bats. Uh, oh yeah, I need to crouch here. Funny, I was accidentally pressing this button the whole time and suddenly I didn't know it anymore. So this is a bat. Yeah. What are they called? Leaf nose Luna, but that's my first bat here. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Meanwhile, in Poland, you can go into the forest and forage your entire dinner. That's uh, very interesting. Made me, but it made me a bit think of part of the German forest is contaminated still since um, Chernobyl. The radiation is still active there. Um, so I think in some areas you should actually not pick anything. I'm not sure if you guys have one of those. Uh, what is this too cold again? It's it's peeping when it's um, when the radiation is too high. In German, it's Geigenzähler. Uh, I didn't know Germany was still dealing with the radiation. Yes, it's still there. Crazy, right? And it's gonna be there. 
uh, Gaika. Yeah, okay, then it's kind of the same. Yeah, uh, the same. Yeah, um, not whole Germany, only the southern part of Germany. So, um, and also not complete southern part, just a couple of forests, I think. I'm not sure. This is also what I heard of, but it's still there. It was a very unfortunate wind in the in the 80s. Reminds me of if you if you if you didn't watch Chernobyl the series, do it. It's insanely good. It's really really good. Look at this frog. No, it's looking so cute. Oh, it's looking it's looking cute. It's a bit sad. Why are you taking pictures of me? <laughs> Remove or use plants from the habitat without res reasonable cause or knock down or otherwise devastate their stands, differ with or destroy their habitats and without reasonable cause. This applies to all species, small and large, common or rare. Yeah, I mean, that's what I, what my mom taught me. Like, hey, what, what, what's going to happen when you're destroying, uh, when you're destroying this? As a child, I loved to jump on mushrooms. I remember that. But my mom got really angry about this and she said, stop doing this. You're destroying the nature. And I never did this again. And she's right. I just, I just did this to have fun with... Oh. You're just destroying stuff. What's this? A plant. What's called? Redined pitcher plant. Okay. How's the book looking like? I think we're done with the f uh, with the flowers. Uh, let me see. The clickety danger machine. It's very very scary. Did you did you guys see Chernobyl, the TV show? Also the documentation. Um, there are so many documentations about that. And I'm not talking about the dark tourism stuff, but the the proper documentation back then and how they were dealing it, like historical wise, it's absolutely insane to me. Uh, nature, nature, it's all about the money. <laughs> well, I didn't do this because uh, mushrooms were bringing money. It was just nice to see how they were making poof. And then you could see the spores were just flying around, but. It's a weird memory, I guess. <laughs> I was a kid, I didn't know. Jumping on mushrooms also sound like a weird hobby. <laughs> Dude, I did this only once. It's not a hobby. I'm not doing this regularly. I only did this once when I was little. We were walking in the, in the forest. And I was wondering what this is and I was jumping on it. It was, I, I like the, <laughs> the sound. <laughs> it's funny that I could remember that. Uh, she's right, yes. As a person, it doesn't seem to have much impact to jump on a mushroom or to pick a couple flowers, but it's usually not one person. Exactly! And now imagine everyone is doing that. Yeah. You can you can destroy a lot of things. Just for my personal amusement? Nah. I don't want to do that. Of course, and I was just a kid. Mm. Where were we? I was uh, taking a picture of this froco. Okay, I think, dude, I found the spider. I, it's right in front of us. Uh, I'm a bit lost here because everything is kind of looking the same now. Oh no, that's the bat. I also don't like that. Oh. <laughs> Look at this big booty. They, they're okay because they're kind of looking like jewelry a bit, huh? So that's a good idea. Yeah, that was the spire. I'm glad we found it. I hope that was the last one. Yep. Dragonfly, snail, and ladybug, and pond skater. The pond skater could also look a bit... Yeah. We're gonna see. Oh. Actually, could we also look in like an ant, right? Okay, never mind. It has... Oh, okay. Nope, you got definitely too many eyes for my taste. <laughs> that actually sounds like they started some creepy <laughs> German fairy tale, <laughs> the uh, very old ones. I also figured out the <laughs> the old Danish ones are also creepy. I think just in general, those old folklore stories are super creepy. This is where we came from, right? I'm a bit lost here. Nature destroys anonymous. <laughs> Hi, I'm Fenexa, and I like to jump on. <laughs> Oh my god, I should have told this story. Phoenix of the mushroom jumper. 
I like mushrooms. They're very tasty. This way, right? Anything new? I saw something flying or it was my gen imagination. No. Oh, it's the same bats. Dude, I'm so scared of bats. Even though they're looking cute. Why am I still crouching? Isn't this the beginning? I'm so confused, old. Isn't this where we started? Yeah. I remember falling in love with this frog. <laughs> yep, this is where I came from. Yep, you're right. You're right. So let's see. Chad, I, Chad it's your fault. I'm getting lost in the forest. Actually getting lost in the forest. Are those your babies? <gasps> oh no, sad babies. They're all sad looking. Don't be sad. I'm going to leave you. I'm going to leave you here. You're getting lost like you said to get <laughs> I am. I am. My orientation sounds is actually not good. Oh, wait a second. But we didn't have this earlier. Started dragging. Oh. It's some kind of a dragon, huh? <laughs> Hello. We have watched a movie at school about Chernobyl. Unfortunately, we didn't do this, but I was always very interested in um, yeah, history, to be honest. And it's not even that far ago. And lately, they, they built another sarcophag, I think it's called, right? Oh my god, that was super expensive. And I think uh, the European Union also helped out there. Because we're all affected by that. We're all, all going to get affected by this. It's very scary. It's a terror you actually can't see. You can't smell it. You can't see it. But... Uh, you can feel it, but not at the beginning. It's going to take some time, depends uh, how the radiation is. And you can only see it if you're having those counters, the, the Geiger counters. Where's a catfish? A big one, right? Dude, they're not that big in real life, right? Everything in nature has a great use and we shouldn't treat mother nature with respect. And your mother is 100% right. And if every mother teaches her child not to destroy things, uh, uh, one only, then the world would not be as it is today. It is in the case, any case, very nice that your mother explained it to this to you. Of course, if you're not explaining things, th you're, not, you're not learning this, right? I was also never chasing um, any animals. I never did this. I think it's also because I grew up with birds. <laughs> and I always saw, I'm al today I'm still seeing kids running after uh, pigeons. It's making me so sad and aggressive. I never did this. My mom always said, no, you never did this because we, I guess because we had birds at home and I, I knew if I'm going to do that, I'm going to scare them or even if you know, I'm going to step, then I'm going to hurt them. I don't want to hurt any animals. I don't want to scare anyone. No. I just like to jump on mushrooms. <laughs> what a rascal. At least it's a cute otter. No, that's not an otter. Right. Crocodile? Otter dial? When does my grandpa wrote about these mischievous otter dials? Okay. Oh, this is our new objective then. Ah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. No, that's that was also not a catfish. It is a Maravillan scaled otter. By the rivers of Maravilla nests a family of curious mam mammalian reptiles. The classification of these creatures is hard to decipher, much like the creatures I encountered in the canopy a few days ago. These creatures have an otter-like body but swim li uh, laterally a characteristic similar to reptiles, such as crocodiles. So it's everything, um, some kind of everything. Maybe it's even a catfish. Scaled skin and whiskers. <laughs> They're extremely acrobatic and perform masterful flips before they dive to grab objects from the riverbed. It seems they have fun doing it too. This is, by the way, such a nice sketch here. It's super hard to do some movements on bodies, especially on animals, especially on Animals like this? It's super hard for me, at least. Mm, these creatures have a unique hunting method. To conserve energy for playtime, they stay very still and camouflage as logs. <laughs> Funny. <laughs> Skate patterns mimic local fungi. Whistling is a play behavior. Doing so will invite the scale otter to prank you with water play by spitting water at you. <laughs> 
I was given one or two unintended baths by making high-pitched noises near bodies of water. <laughs> Today I witnessed something amazing. A swarm of fireflies flew across the river, ripening a fruit with their light. When these otters eat their, this luminous fruit, chemical reactions within their bodies cause them to glow like a discotheque. Mirrored drawings cannot capture the beauty of their dazzling scales. I'm soaked with the river water and otters bit. I suspected they were defending territory, but after observing them spring water at each other and any other interesting targets, it's clear that they have having fun at my expense. Such intelligent little rascals. <laughs> I splashed them back, and that's earned me a, fa a place in the family. Today, one of the otters gifted me a smooth stone from the riverbed. Its shape and pattern are both captivating. I considered taking it with me as a keepsake, but something stayed my hand. I had a strange notion that taking something from the island, even something as trivial as a pebble, might disrupt the delicate balance of its ecosystem. I'm running low on supplies, and despite how kind this island has been to me thus far, I do not think I am brave enough to try and subsist off of its unidentified plans. It seems I must draw my current expedition to a close. I'm eager to share what I've discovered. What dwells here is something that deserves to be cherished by the world. I cannot locate this place on any chart, so I must use some guesswork in trying to return to the mainland. I'm no expert, but I think my navigation skills are sufficient to bring me home. As I stand on the beach now, I feel a sort of sadness, not just within myself, but in the air around me. This island has been greatest, my greatest adventure. I can only hope that this will not be its final chapter. Goodbye for now, Maravilla, but not forever. And this is the letter from the beginning. All right, but this is uh, the objective photos. Um, we're missing three plants, we're missing five bats, four bugs, four frogs as well. And then we need to find the otter dial um, doing a flip while being camouflaged, also spitting and also glowing. That's going to be interesting. Yeah. Uh, let me see, what did I miss? Being radioactive gives a whole new meaning to the compliment. <laughs> you're glowing. You're right, because you're glowing is something... Some, something nice when you're saying when you're saying to someone hey you're glowing it's like hey you're looking very happy and you're looking very positive mind with a with a you're like having a positive mindset did we get catfished by an otter looking like if <laughs> i think so <laughs> i think so yeah mm. that was one of the reasons why i uh, stopped my traineeship oh really they were treating the pigeons like vermins. They wanted to do something to them, uh, but I sat them all without me. Oh, damn. And they, they put... Wow, okay. That's the reason why they put um, some of the, the worlds, right, on the, on the roof, so they're not sitting there. Damn, this is, oh, this is breaking my heart. But it was very, very strong of you mentioning this. <laughs> it's, yeah, it's um, crazy to me that pigeons got such a bad reputation. These animals are completely misunderstood. Completely. They have such a bad reputation, which is actually not true. It's, uh, it makes me sad every time. Every time. I, I have saved a lot of pigeons already. Um, when I'm seeing uh, a pigeon or just in general an animal um, wounded, I'm always taking it with me. I had so many. So many pigeons at home <laughs> and helping out. Yeah, I, I understand that, Doc. Oh, damn. Makes me sad to hear, but you did the right thing, in my opinion. What's new here? I can bring dragonfly captured. Dragon. Oh, this one? No. Oh, whoops. Well, <laughs> they can definitely fly away. <gasps> And this one? It's also new. Sunset bed. Wish I could take better pictures. But they're all hiding. Do you do it? Um 
I need to find the sp uh, special places again, right? Uh, uh, aren't you afraid of bringing back avian diseases back to your own verbs, though? No, uh, because they're quarantined. I'm not bringing. I'm not bringing um, another bird to my to my flock, uh, to my group of uh, birdies. I'm never doing this. When I'm having a bird uh, from outside, then they are gonna stay completely. Uh, Guaranteed. And I'm, if I'm getting uh, another bird, at least it should be two weeks. They're not going to the group. Zazu was one of those birds. Zazu had a, a disease which was actually very infectious for humans as well. Um, it was also very dangerous, but we all did good. We all did good. Nothing happened in the end. That's the pond skater. Also kinda no, it's not looking disgusting. I was expecting the worst. <laughs> it, but it's having definitely long legs, huh? How many birds do you have? Currently two. I, I lost uh, one last year recently. I had originally... I had four. You know, I am trying to find, find the right partner, but I don't wanna... I don't wanna buy... I don't wanna buy animals. I wanna adopt them. And it's quite hard to, to find older one. I need one who's around 10 years old. Nine or ten years old, that would be great. But they, um, yeah, they didn't want to, last time they didn't want to give them to me because uh, I've got two boys at home. And they said, no, the girl's going to be stressed and they didn't want to, they didn't want me to adopt one. Which is making me very, very sad. If that's, <laughs> if that's the case, the next time I'm just going to, I'm not going to say I've got another boy there because, um, with uh, with this, I, I can't adopt anymore. And she even the the other bird had even a heart disease. And I said, I don't I don't care about that. I'm experienced with this, and I can take care of this. I am going to the vet as well. Uh, how old can a cockatiel get? They can get 15 years old when they are living um, uh, outside, but inside they can also get 25 if you are lucky. But I'm. Um, I'm rarely seeing the birds are getting older, to be honest. They are kind of tending to get uh, diseases, the typical diseases, which is very known for cockatiels, I figured out. Um, I don't think they're living that long anymore. If I Sometimes I'm seeing this over Reddit. I'm following lots of parrots, uh, subreddits. Sometimes I'm seeing very old cockatiels. They're, they're getting 20, 25. I even saw one 20, 28 or something. You need to have a bird coming from a good gen pool. And that was very unlucky so far. Very, very unlucky. I lost another another burble. Actually, I had five cockatiels so far. Mm. And I lost another burble actually 10 years ago. She was also such a sweetheart. She lived seven years only. That's nothing. Yeah, but I'm, I'm seeing this quite often over Reddit. I don't want to hurt any animals. You can always find a solution bit wire but I don't see them doing things with a high pressure blaster even if we were up to our knees in pigeon poop it's crazy it's crazy makes my heart bleed actually oh, 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 oh thanks for the hug dear dog <laughs> thank you yeah birds are my spirit animals definitely I, I was always fascinated I think I got this also from my mom she had budgies <laughs> Oh, this is also looking nice. Everything is looking nice. So where's this cat otter, otter fish, whatever. <laughs> Miss all boys, I miss them as well, trust me. I said this to Nubi as well. I miss my boys, hopefully they're doing good, but I know they're doing good. Oh, something shiny there. We're gonna, we're gonna lure you now. It's sad, but it's the same with cats and dogs. At some point, they are just done. Yeah, I think it has something to do with breeding over and over again. This is, I talked about my what about this. Um, they're also saying that the gen pool is uh, they're not taking care. There are some people who are breeding animals and they shouldn't do it. They have new experiences and the gen pool is not good. Um, she said she said like birds 20 years ago were different. They, they had a had they had a good immune system as well but over the years things are changing and i think it has something to do that we got <laughs> places like ebay where we can get animals like i don't know you can go to the grocery store and buy <laughs> some bread 
it's crazy to me. Um, I think it should not be allowed like that. And then there is there are people who are also buying animals um, in in other countries where people <laughs> maybe not even give. Yeah, they don't care about the animals there as well. It's a huge problem. It it is actually a huge problem. Um, it was quite interesting to talk about this uh, with a person who's uh, yeah who learned about that stuff, who studied this stuff, and I mean they have definitely more experience than me. If you're working in this job for 40 years, then you, you can definitely see what's going on, right? When there's a demand for a certain animal, everyone, and their granny start breeding them without thinking of the... Co yeah, it, because it's also so easy. It's so easy. But you, sh <laughs> you, need, to, you need to think about what you're doing. Um, I think we need to take a picture of this, right? So, because this is shiny? No, never mind. How is this working now? Because this is shiny. Do I need to take it? P I need to pick it up. I'm going to throw it. You want to eat this? Can you please do this again? Oh, wait a sec. Oh my god, I was too slow. Oh, you want to play? There you go. <laughs> it's like suddenly I'm having a dog. That was not a... Oh, where am I? Wait a sec, is this part of the quest? What is it? Spitting, glowing, flipping. Oh, I need, oh my God, guys, I need to get a good timing here. I will never get this. Uh-huh. Boop. Does this count? No, right? Flipping. And I think I've missed the camouflage one. Oh no, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna make this. Oop. I got it now. Wow, okay. Wow, this is such a bad picture by the way. Look at that. <laughs> I'll take it. It reminds me a lot of Pokemon Snap here. My cat was a street cat that I took uh, from Turkey. Had a lot of problems. I put a lot of energy, tears, and strength, especially loving my little girl. But at some point, I went with her to to the end. Yeah, I, I'm I'm still sad about this. I'm very very sad about this. But I also know that you did your absolute best, Doc. I know this. You you did your absolute best. I'm <laughs> I'm I'm glad she had a had a good home with you, and I'm glad you took care of her. And yeah, it's always very stressful if you are really adopt if you want to really adopt um, an animal from uh, another country. You need a lot of certificates, documents, and vaccines and whatever. So <laughs> I know what she did there, so and I really appreciate it. And I'm very sure she also appreciated that. I'm very sure about that. Used to keep hamsters. We were always super selective on where we got them because uh, there's things like hamsters farms. They just churn out them. Like a bright and big. Oh my god. This should be so illegal. It's so illegal, yeah. Crazy. It's crazy. We should not treat our animals like this. But these people don't care. They only see the money, the easy making money. Because they're always going to get babies, right? Mm. That makes me very sad. But. I'm also it makes me also happy that you guys were taking care of where you're actually getting the animal from. What is this? Some sort of hide and seek? All right, you little rascal airplane. Now where could you be? Uh, you're probably this one. <laughs> Camouflage behavior because we were reading the book, so that was super easy. <laughs> Splitting, spitting, and glowing, and some kind of frogs, bugs, bats, and three plants. Which way to go? This is where we came from. Oh, this is new. Oh, hello, froggo. Oop. New dart frog. Oh, what's this? What? New toadstool captured. What? No, 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 no. I want to know. What's this? Question mark? 
On the other side, maybe. Is this the right way? <laughs> Okay, you can jump over there. Okay, I think this is the right way. Oh, you can also jump here. Oh, no. Oh, part of the problem lies with the owner as well, though. Because barely anyone is willing to bring a hamster to the vet since they only live for three on average. Not to speak about the living conditions people put hamsters in. Yep, I think it's the same with... Um, it's pretty much the same with... Um, what was the other one called? Not hamsters. Uh, the little... Guinea pigs, right? But I also know it's the same with birds as well. You just have to go to eBay, unfortunately. I want to remove the, the question mark here. Which way should we go? Oh, a fruit bat. Even while flying. Professional. It was the hardest decision ever had to make, even if it was the the best and only solution. Of course. Of course. I, uh, yeah, I also had to say goodbye to, to many, many animals. And every time I'm thinking, nah, I don't want to have new animals anymore. I don't want to have this anymore. <laughs> and then I'm adopting again. <laughs> Also with rabbits. Oh yeah, that's also the case with rabbit steeds. Completely. Mm. Oh, okay. Now I jumped over the here. <sighs> Which way should I go? Should I stay or should I go? Manita rain frog. Reminds me of a uh, game studio. Also, I think it was Machinarium. Also a good game. I played many, many years ago. Oh, oh what a cute you are. Boop. Those people are just not willing to educate themselves on the animal there. Like, no. No. And I saw over Reddit again. A lot of people got <laughs> animals for Christmas. Animals are not Christmas gifts. They are not Christmas gifts. In Germany, we've got so many animal shelters. They are like, okay, if it's December, we're stopping the adoption right now. Oh, I got the, uh, the dragonfly. Uh, because most people are thinking about gifting this. Like, yeah. No, they are not gifts. Animals are not gifts. You, you need to take care of them. And I bet so many animals are going to land in the animal shelter again. How are you, rabbits? They're good. They're good. They're chilling. Luckily, it's not that cold anymore. Thank you for asking. It's kind. They're getting lots of snacks. <laughs> I mean, rabbit snacks, of course. And most of the time, it's like special kind of uh, grass they're getting with lots of um, different kind of flowers. Good flowers. <laughs> kind of you that you're asking. Dun, dun, dun. We also need a rabbit cam, huh? On the balcony. <laughs> <laughs> She'd get a bigger house and just turn it into... It reminds me of my mom. She always says uh, she wants to have a big house, but she wants to use it as a farm. <laughs> she wants to have like a, uh, a big farm with different kind of animals. Donkeys are also nice. I want to have a donkey. I'm going to go this way, I think. I think that Otterdal is still hiding around here. Uh, don't we... D hiding. I need to pick... Ah, I need to take a picture of the hiding one. No, we did this. Camouflage. What? But I did this already. Oh, I can take another one. This one. Not amused about my picture, huh? <laughs> I understand that. But we did this. Let's see. Maybe we can go over. Oh, imagine all the expenses though. All the feed and all the... <laughs> that's also what I'm saying to her. Yeah, that's the reasonable um, brain science saying that. No, it's expensive. I mean, you can see this with animal shelters. They always need donations. Always. Um, and the, the state is also... The government also needs to help them. Most of them, they... 
have trouble to yeah to get proper food oh my god what the hell she's become a millionaire for <laughs> good idea good idea uh, how to get uh, how to be a millionaire wow it's so intimidating up close now i get why the binky is from i really ran off why does it seem so angry haven't done anything wrong have i i'm just here It's glowing again, and the jam piece is going off again even more intensely than before. I'll need to connect it. I have to figure out what's going on. But how did Grandpa expect me to handle that fierce creature? <sighs> I have to keep going. I can do this. Hopefully. There was something new again. The mushroom? Huh? The toad. Violet capped toad. Well, I can't... No. Well, I'll take it though. <laughs> hmm. I'm honest, I have not educated myself with cats, but I cannot leave them alone. They could, they would not have survived long or would have been put to sleep, fortunately. They have changed the, the Loring Turkey. I'm, I'm glad they changed it. I'm really glad about that. Oh! Oh, th I like those bugs! Lady... Oh, those are ladybugs. A fancy one. I think there's going to be another interaction here. What what one was left? Uh, spitting and glowing. I feel like I'm missing <laughs> some plants. Not gonna lie, I'm having hard trouble here to, to see new stuff, so this is why I'm doing this with my, my camera. It already has light shining on it, but it's not glowing. Maybe these plants need light and water to grow. <laughs> and I already know how much this rascal loves spitting water and stuff. Uh, maybe I need to take a picture? No, that would be too easy, huh? What do you have to do? Uh. Can I do something here? Moonlight glory captured. You see, I'm thinking, well, maybe this is something special, but it's not. Uh. Cats are pretty self-sufficient, though. But some animals need certain living conditions. The camps are needed at least 100 to 50 centimeters in space to roam around. Plenty of space to dig, very specific food work finds. That's true, yeah. That's true. I agree. Um. Hmm. What to do, chat? I didn't pay attention. A spit water. So there is a flower needs some light, but then what? I forgot. <laughs> uh whistling wait a second wait 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 i got it i got it but now we're done but something with this objective twinkle night light lily da, 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 da. What next? You have to go back? Glowing. Okay. I guess... I need to go back? Do I have to do that? I got I don't have a good feeling by doing this to be honest. Feels like I'm I'm doing something wrong. Hmm. We're here because I said this one is cute. It's it's very cute. 
Oh, there's even one another sitting here. Hello, cutie. So, I think we need to solve the puzzle, but I don't know how. But then you get people that put them in a tiny 42, 40 cross 30 cage with plastic toys, a running wheel that's three sizes too small, and wood fibers to cover the bottom, which fans just can't even deal with health. One, yeah. The the problem is also you can't get those easy. You can't get those stuff, or wannabe toys, whatever this uh, this is. You can't get them easily in 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 pet shops. And um, it's oh, even when I'm seeing the cages, some of the cages are oh, it should be illegal to be honest. Yeah, it is. It is uh, basically torture. Yeah, I agree. I agree. The shops are. It, the shops should know better. They, they, they just also. Buy, they are buying the the wrong stuff and then they're selling the wrong stuff. I had this so many times. No, I think this is not the right way. The story was leading me to this place here. So I need to do something with this flower. <laughs> Wait a second, maybe I'm... Hmm, maybe he needs to spit here. Hello, look at me. Ah! Can I jump here? Oh, this is how it works. Very nice. I mean, you don't have many game mechanics, but I'm glad it worked out. Anything new? Looks like a fairy tale, you know? <gasps> There's the deer again. I I always wanted to take a picture, but I'm always missing out. Chop, chop. Well, the shops are selling the wrong stuff because it sells easier like that, so much more profit. I hate the plastic stuff. Don't expect that many people in patch shops actually know much about animals beyond the very basic. But this is what you are doing, right? I mean, <laughs> when you're getting new stuff, you want to <laughs> you wanna know what... Y you want to know what's going on, let's say this way. At least I'm a person who is curious and I, I would like to know. The, also, the stuff I'm buying just in general. All frogs. Nice. Hopted. Very nice. Oh. Now we need the glowing part. Let's see how to do that. First of all, let's figure out. If we're missing here something. Seems like my Otodai friend wants some fruit. That looks like the tree from before, but it's so much larger than the first one. Which tree? There are so many trees. <laughs> well, I know the f that fireflies can help the uh, the tree drop its fruits. Its fruit, but I think it's going to take a lot of fireflies to do the trick. Come on, Paul, do for me now. Let's be friends and fry fireflies. So I need to collect them now. Are you hungry? I'm also hungry. <laughs> I'm also. I'm just also hungry. How how did I do that? I just need to collect them, right? This is looking like a moth. Oh no, no, I don't like bats. I'm scared of them. Look at this frog booty. Same for me. I had uh, one patch up when I lived in the Netherlands. I went to because they actually know about the animals and how to create proper living conditions. Didn't have anything under size for any type of animal. And I'm, I'm glad you're, yeah, you're doing research about that. <laughs> it's, um, yeah, I don't know. I'm, I'm doing always, I'm always doing research, no matter what. If it's a, if it's a pet or anything I'm buying. And I'm always thinking a lot when I am purchasing stuff. The shop doubled as a zoo as well. I see. Well, I it's nice that if you have like a, a, a shop you can trust like that. 
had a shop like this, but they moved. They moved away, unfortunately. Oh my god, this is looking creepy. Oh, never mind. This is not the mouth. Never mind. That's the belly. Now it's cute again. <laughs> not a booty picture. <laughs> I like how they're closing their their eyes differently. It making it making it more cute, cute Overthinking all the thing. Yup, that's the way I go. <laughs> yeah, you probably also know this feeling then. Mm -hmm. How can I get the, the? Where are the fireflies even? Oh, those pinkies uh, over there. And where's the fruit? I can't even see the fruit. Boop, boop, boop. Oh, oh wow! I like this one. I like the purple snail. Looks like there's four more groups of fireflies up on the rocks. I'm sure they can help me light up this huge tree. What's this huge tree? Am I blind to see? They're all huge! Just need to find a way to get up to them. All bugs done among the stores. Oh, the. We got any achievement, but the logo is looking. That's definitely spider, guys. This super snare. It's, like, it's nice looking, right? Am I gonna yoink this? Can I yoink that? I can't. Oh, you're following me. Come, come. What are we even missing? Let me quickly see. Um. The glowing one, it's gonna happen soon. Two bats and one plant. Okay. Oh, bats. Dude, they're flying around. It's gonna be hard. Mm. Okay, you need some light. A light there. Oh, this is where the puzzle part comes. There you go. Oh. Now it's bigger. Wait a second, what am I doing here? So what am I doing with? I can't jump though. This poor snail. Can I eat this? You want this? Oh, I can't throw it to you. Oh, this is the snail food. How can I get the, the dragonflies? Uh, let me get this one first because this is easy clap. I hope the snail is not following me now. Don't follow me. You're going to die, I assume. <laughs> Catch it in your master ball. You want to have an amethyst snail? I didn't know that. Uh, oh, just likes uh, snails uh, as well. What's this? Even toads, dude. This is so confusing. Need bats and plants. Okay. Uh. Huh. <sighs> Now we need to think in in, in lines. <laughs> See, it's also cute. <laughs> they carry their homes in their bags, <laughs> like a camping trick. A uh, trick. Uh, trip. Oh my! I can't speak anymore. I can't move. What's happening? Oh, I was pressing Q instead of A. <laughs> uh. How can I do this? So making this smaller. And this is where I can place it. Well, we don't want to place it here. Do we? Hey, 
It took me two months to buy my snowboard because I wanted to know everything. I used to know because I bought... Of course, I did the same with my longboard. It took me a long time to decide which one I want to get. And uh, you can you can adjust so many things there as well. I did the same with my with my bike as well. Every time there is like a huge investment or thinking stuff I am thinking about having for long term, then I will think about this, of course. I am not that spontaneous. <laughs> Electric longboards now for com for coming. Zone. That's nice. Unfortunately, they're not legal in Germany. But I was riding on one um, some time ago. That was super fun. Wait a second. I, <laughs> I wanted to jump. I wanted to jump up, but I can just walk up. Well. They, ah! I was thinking, how can I do this? Wait, that, well, that wasn't here before, right? Am I crazy? And how can I go to the other side? There is some kind of weird loopholes for electrical loop, uh, longboards. I, I didn't hear anything of this. The thing is, there was an electrical longboard I was using that was, you could drive up to 45 kilometers per hour. So officially you need a dri not, not just a driving license, but also a, a plate, like your official plate. And back then, uh, the insurances, they were, they, they were not giving these plates to longboards. Maybe they changed with the, uh, with the scooters. But I have no idea, I didn't do any research about this anymore. Um... Wait a second. How can I get there? I need I need high ground. Oh no, never mind. I also don't know how to get there. Thank you. What are those crystals e exactly doing? Well, let me see. I'm going to take away. I'm going to take away this one. Wait a second. But I'm also... Hmm, this one is getting smaller now. Do I need this on the right side? Another flower I'm missing? No. Then I need this. How can you go up there? I'll find it out for you if you want. I got a friend that found it about it. Uh, it's fine. I can also do some research. I think it's just over 10 years ago when, when I did this the last time, to be honest. But thank you. You want a hint? A tip? Yeah, why not? I'm a bit stuck here. Uh, thank you for asking. Um, instead of just uh, giving... Uh, Unsolided tips here. I appreciate that. Thank you for asking. Wait, this is big now because the the lamp is there. <laughs> the lamp. I need some kind of reflection, but that's not going to happen, right? Because it's not shining through. The flower that grow with the light are those elevator flowers. Um. You mean, um, which flowers? When the otter spits on it? Oh yeah, the otter needs to spit, but where's the otter? Here. Oh. Give me a second. Oh no, this is not what I wanted to do, but we also can do this quickly. Ah, uh, there you go. Um, I think there was a different kind of one. Hello! 
Nah, this has something to do with the light. And I'm moving. The snail is getting attracted by the apple. With this, it's shining over there. Okay, what can I do with this? I don't get on. I don't understand the purpose. The first light needs to shine on it when the altar needs to spit. The altar is not going to spit. Uh, you mean the altar is going to spit on the, the crystal? The altar is not even here. Where is it? Well, oh, you're here. Give me a second. Let me let me see. Do that. Oh, of course, we did this. Ah, oh, we did this earlier. When it yeah, when it's big, of course that makes sense. Thank you. Same here. Yeah, I, I just did it like five minutes ago. <laughs> How could I forget this? Yeah. <laughs> Well, easy clap. Because I was also thinking, how can I, how can I just go up there? Yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> and the otter is also following us. Yep. Well, <laughs> thank you, thank you. I will join the apple. I'm so sorry for doing that. Okay, where is my otter baby? Oh no! Look at me! Wait, wait, wait! The flower! No, do it again! There you go, but we need the... No. Where is my snail? Oh, my snail is super, super... slow <laughs> this one is so tricky snake why are you not moving come i hope it counts i hope it's not gonna be super super picky because the first time you did it there was already a big conversation <laughs> i guess so yeah <laughs> Fenexa the forgetful, yeah, a bit, because finally someone in chat who's understanding this. My my community is always like, hey, hey, Mimi forgetful. <laughs> <laughs> this should be enough fireflies. Come on, friends, let's go uh, light up that tree. Which tree? <laughs> now the question, which tree? <laughs> there are so many. First of all, I'm going to give you your apple back. I feel bad for yoinking the apple and using you. Let me place this back. I don't think we need it anymore. No. Enjoy. Now we need to find a tree. Let's let's try every tree. Uh -huh. Maybe here. Somewhere. Wait, where am I? Oh my god, they're... Oh god, I lost... Uh, I, I, I really thought we lost them. We're just a bit uh, uh, slow. Which tree? We're gonna get rid of them here, right? Need to keep following the deer, but it's uh, this waterfall is too powerful right now. Try to find a way through later. Okay, which tree? Oh, this one. Ah, uh, I think it's this one, the purple one, the deep purple one. I've never said such a no. <laughs> Not you, no. <laughs> You should, you should have seen me when I played uh, Half-Life. Oof, that was hard. There you go, it's this one. I remember this. Enjoy your food! Oh, And it should glow now, right? Time to take it another picture. <laughs> Half-Life? No, that has been extremely long ago. I never played it, actually. 
Um, I started playing it um, this year. And I'm glad I finished it now, finally. <laughs> was also on my backlog for a long, long time. It came up. Oh my god! Newbie, stop! Well, we could get keep up tomorrow, actually. He's making me hungry. I have hunger. Newbie! We should, we should have cooked properly today, huh? You can get my two evil scale if you want to. Oh, look at them! Now we can go there. Ooh la la. Let's do it. But I'm still... Guys, I'm missing some stuff. I'm missing bats. Oh, speaking of bats. Wooly ghost bats. And what else? A plant, right? Um, no, 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 no. This one. A glowing one, one bat, and one plant. There's so many plants here. There's so many. Oi! Is this the glowing one or jumping one? <gasps> no, it is glowing! Oh, wow! Oh, this is beautiful. Utter this world achievement. <laughs> Why did you do for dinner? You're right. Actually, I, I think I'm gonna I'm gonna do this tomorrow then. It's a that's a good idea. <laughs> I play Half-Life 2 again, but there are just certain levels I do not feel like playing again. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I think I know what you're talking about. This city, which was insanely creepy. What was the name again? I forgot. We've got an expert here in chat. Uh, his name is Pan. He knows everything about. Ra Thank you, Raven. Oh, yeah, that makes me feel very uncomfortable. Very, very uncomfortable. I feel. Yeah. I had a feeling. We talk about this one, right? <laughs> anything new? Uh, give me a second. No, that's not the one. I'm always pressing the wrong button. Camouflaging. Spitting. My pictures are not that good. Why is this not counting? Weird. Oh, the sad family. All the pictures are bluish and purple here. I like this one. There's an achievement I still need to get there. Oh no! I heard some of the achievements are brutal. They are super, super hard. You can only use the gravity gun and it just seems too... <sighs> yeah, that's one of the achievements. I w yeah, I'm not gonna get this one. That sounds like I would not enjoy the game anymore. Mm -mm. That's too much for my heart. I, I can't take this dates. I can't. <laughs> There's no way I'm gonna do that. Do you wanna do this? That sounds brutal. I took so many pictures here. At some point I wanna do that. I'm wishing you best of luck for, for trying actually. Maybe you can get it. Would be nice. But personally, I think I would... I would probably destroy something. <laughs> no, I can't. Since you got the urge to start 100% in games. That's a good idea. I think you're getting lots of... Uh, lots out of a game when you're doing this. But it, for me, it highly depends what, what kind of game it is. Is this the last bet I'm searching for? Yes, all bets done. Echo located, the achievement it's called. And now I'm missing the last plant. Oi, that's going to be hard. Well, well, well. Where's the deer, though? 
think we're reaching the end now. Mm. Yeah, one plant, <laughs> please. I need to find the plant. I want to get that. Oh, Maria, yeah, what's this? Oh, we found something here. Can I just pick this up instead of just taking a picture? Let me see. Oh, yeah. I could... Wait a second. Oh, yeah. I was half delirious when they found me adrift at sea. Maybe that's why no one believed me. When I told them of Maruya's magic, they dismissed me without a second thought. I suppose I was lucky to have been found at all. They may not believe me, but I will prove it to them. I can find my way back. I know I can. I will get proof this time. I will prove to them that there is something out there greater than us all. Something worth protecting. I'll do whatever it takes. So there was a page missing. He never told me he came back to the island. Maybe it's a, maybe it's the last flower. I'm getting too excited now. Wait. What does that... What does he mean by whatever it takes? Did Grandpa do something? I thought he wanted to help the creatures of the island. Just... Doesn't make any sense. Another achievement. Whatever it takes. Discover the lost journal page. Huh. Funnily enough, I decided to start doing that on an essence creed creed Odyssey. Which is 39 93 not 39 achievements total. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I am um, I really would like to play um Assassin's Creed Odyssey as well at some point. Mm. But uh, right now, I'm, I'm trying not to touch sandboxy games. I think this is a too big of a game to to get the achievements first. I <laughs> then I right now I'm preferring these kind of smaller games, um, and I really don't mind when they are short. If I'm getting a good story and good uh, some couple of hours of gameplay and a bit of achievements, I can also do that. Forty-one hours and one hundred. Forty-one percent of one hundred. Yeah, this is what I. Uh, thought. You're ready to adventure on board. You will not be able to return this on this area for a while. That's okay. I'm missing one plant. I I'll do this off stream. I'll do this off stream. I couldn't find the other one. I got distracted by chat. <laughs> Let's see. Or is this another area? What happened on this island? Oh, there are even more. Wait a second. How big is this game? <laughs> Never mind, it's going further. I really thought I could uh, finish this game today, but I think um, this is a bigger chapter here. That was only my my photography book. What's my journal even saying uh, with R? Yeah, I think there is coming something new here. Painted Plateau. Huh. Molten copper leafed gecko. I'm actually super happy. I really thought it's gonna be a smaller game, but okay, I'll take it. Um, what are the objectives this time? Ornamental crystalline bugs. When I arrived on Maravilla for the second time, I progressed as quickly as I could through the jungle and the river, hoping to find my answer in the untapped depth of the island. I was rewarded with a breathtaking whist of towering rocks and endless sky and some familiar bugs. Fuzzy, more denied body. Generally, their colors are more understated than those I've seen before. There are some exceptions, of course. I have run into a few species with stunning patterns and colors that they are more than happy to show off. Dazzling makeup, dome and flap. Oh, that's a spine! No! Mama got too many eyes! Oh, this is one uh, <laughs> reminding me of the game Wandering Village. A super nice game. I am excited to play this when it's uh, out of early access. Gilded Reptiles. The reptiles of, of the plateau are hardly, uh, hardly a lot. Their hides are coated in plates and spines which resemble various metals. Gold inlaid shell. Damn, fancy. They are most cautious out of any creature. I have discovered that so far, with each having a unique defense mechanism. Oxidized copper coloration. 
It is logical to conclude that there must be a particularly fearsome predator here to warrant their wariness, but have yet to encounter anything of the sword. Archaic raptors. I had an encounter with one of the Plateau Savian residents that made me fear for a moment. But I had been thrown back in time. Scaly facial frills and teeth. Okay, that's scary. A bird with teeth is scary. <laughs> Indeed, the birds here share little resemblance with those I saw in the jungle. And have traits which border on saurian or perhaps dino dinosaurian would be more um, apt. Horned owl with actually bony horn protrusions. Reminds me there was <laughs> there was Harry Potter running on Danish TV today. <laughs> it is possible that there are a surviving evolutionary link between rep reptiles and birds, making them something like livid living fossils. Oh, that sounds super nice. I like this area. I like this area. But I think we're gonna do this the next time, Burbles. Because I just checked out, it's pretty late already. I know we're holidays, but I don't want to mess up my my sleeping schedule that far uh, <laughs> too much even though it's probably gonna happen but um <laughs> I'm, I'm trying i'm trying not to um i'm gonna save this here and um mm -hmm. we're going back to the main menu and uh, yeah i would like to say thank you so so much for playing this beautiful and wonderful game called the base of maravilla island it's super super fun the puzzles are okay i just uh, got a bit stuck <laughs> with with the otter fish uh, spitting on one of the flowers <laughs> but thanks to deeds for helping me out here but uh, just in general thank you so so much for tuning in and hanging out with me it was so nice to talk to you guys <laughs>